All right, I'll see you guys back at that spot. All right, guys, I'm back at this spot. Ooh, let's do some practice. What's going on, Coke? What's up, everybody? We're doing some uh, practice here on the back three again. What's up, everybody? Before we jump into an actual run. Hey, D Mart. What is up? We got Q Imp in here. Gats and Guts is here. Coplex. Miss Pleasure. Hoseki, what's going on? W Starlights, how's it going? Lima Whiskey, what's going on? Simzy. Yeah, we got a bunch of people in here today. Hello. First time chatting. What's going on, noble elite? How are you doing? What's up, everybody? Local hourglass. What's going on? We're it's doing some practicing boys. right now. By the way, we're doing some back three practicing. We'll get into some runs in a little bit after we do work on this a little bit because these levels we definitely need to practice. Snap my coffee. Oh my god. Oh my god. Does anyone know when the patch is coming out? I want my trophies. <laughs> I, yeah, I wish I knew. I wish I knew. I wish I knew, man. That patch needs that patch needs to hurry the frick up. <laughs> we'll get it eventually. I would much rather have them take their time and get it right than to drop a half-assed patch where it actually breaks more things in it. I forgot to put on the sunglasses again. This is the this is what practice is gonna be, huh? I'm just gonna forget the sunglasses every time. This is BS. What's up, HGK over on YouTube? What's up? Good evening, ex Nemo. Raider Scott, what's going on? It will be fixed. We all have to be patient. We can't play all hollows. No, we can't. It'll be fixed. And if it's not, then I hate these remasters. <laughs> it's that simple, man. This is easy. It's easy. This came from uh, GDQ, and they were speedrunning TR1. The gamer died and loaded so many times it gave me a, a new appreciation for what I do. Oh, that's. Well. I mean, speedrunners, their goal isn't necessarily to... Their only goal is to beat the game as fast as possible. Doesn't matter if they die. Um, if they are dying, then... Usually it's due to some um, weird jump or something they're trying to do. That saves a lot of time somewhere. You think Atlas Mines benefited so much from the remaster? Yeah, the uh, the update is amazing for Atlas Mines. This level is still kind of annoying because of all the back and forth you got to do. But if you know the shortcuts, honestly, you only really back and forth once. But I like I, I think I like this level a lot more now when they remastered than I did in the original. <laughs> You 
you'd rather watch a speed runner figure out the strats used rather than speed run itself yeah well, that's, that's always the that's where you learn stuff yourself if you're watching a speed runner you're they're going so fast through all the stuff that they've learned that really it's hard to learn stuff for yourself but i can pick stuff up on a speed runner watching a speed runner in fact i picked up a few things quite a few things watching speed runs or going to other people's channels or whatever. Oops. I always seem to forget this. They're very skilled though. Oh, absolutely. What's up, Jellyfish Nexus? Spud wieners? What? Hey, Urban Enam, what's going on? Natoon! What's up? Hello. Welcome in. Any specific speedrunner I watched? Matt, well, yeah, Foodie's good. Foodie's like, I don't know. My, I think he's honestly the top. He's freaking crazy good at Tomb Raider. Um... Really, not really watching speedrunners per se. I'm usually, um, I, I know I watched a little bit of Action Turnip. Um, I watched, uh, lately I've been just kind of swinging by other people's streams and just saying what's up. They're playing Tomb Raider or whatever. Uh, the 420 Benny, I've been into his streams. He does some pretty cool stuff with Tomb Raider. I've picked up a few moves from him. Whether or not he learned them somewhere else, I have no idea, but either way. It's always fun to watch somebody else play, too, because um, you always tend to like, oh, man, I didn't think of doing it that way. I'll be at tier three for the first time ever in my life because of me. Oh, nice. Yeah, I get, I get that a lot, actually. You're speedrunning TR2 right now? Oh, dude. Kate C91, what's up? TR3 is hard. Yeah. What's up, everybody? Definitely the hardest of the three. Hardest of the first five classics for sure. Ooh, I almost fell down. I think it would have been fine, though. You still haven't beat Tier 4 at YouTube? Yeah, I mean, you should. It's a, it's actually, a, it's a really fun game. Uh, tier 4 is definitely a good, tomb, a really good Tomb Raider game. Ain't nothing personal. Alright, let's hope I don't get shot at. Oh god. I see life bar. Okay, I don't see life bar. Four for you is the hardest. I mean, to each their own, obviously. Uh, uh, difficulty is subjective. For the, um, I mean, mostly objective is subjective to some degree. <laughs> I think that the difficulty between two meter four and three is within the realm of. You could be a flexibility in the subjectivity there. But. This is a practice run. Currently, it is. Currently, it is. We will be doing some um, real runs later. But yes, right now we're just. 
in the practice. Oh, it's your birthday, Lady Wise? Well, happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday, you're old. You are very old, very old. You're a bad man. <laughs> uh. It's a glorious hole, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Happy 21st birthday, Lady Wise. <laughs> you are turning very yeah, old. Well, you your know, skin is like, kind uh, of wrinkly. Your opinion, man. <laughs> that slope is such a mini heart attack. It is. Fortunately, it always puts you right on the edge of that platform. Got to move this box, man. 25 plus value added tax. When do TRLE runs start again? <clears throat> um, Maybe next weekend. Maybe I continue doing these runs because uh, these are fun and I'm enjoying these remasters. And right now I'm in between a TRLE. Like I finished one right when these remasters dropped, so it was perfect. And to pick one up... um. I'd have to I'd be in between it, so I was like, well, you know what? I might as well do some runs first. We might just do some more tier leads next weekend, though. We'll see. Just depends on what kind of mood I'm in. I don't want to make any promises on any in any way, though. Come on, man. Give me give me the goods. There we go. Amicia. Hey, Matt, watched you on Twitch a few years ago. Awesome. What? You, yeah, I'm still on Twitch, by the way. I need to get figure out how to get the uh, YouTube chat into the stream. It's a glorious hole, isn't it? All right, so Skater Kid is always going to be a cock block for real. Like, he's going to be... He's got a cock shield the size of a freaking pyramid. So we're going to have to work our best to try to not spawn him. Um, That's fine. This is honestly... This kind of skip is legal because you're just jumping, really. Like, there's nothing illegal about jumping, but oh, looks like it looks like it worked. Looks like it worked. Okay, cool. That's what we want. Perfect. Let's just hope we can do that in the middle of a run. Or if we do, if we don't do it in the middle of a run, then we have to kill him. I might as well ch uh, practice killing him because it is a pain in the ass for those times when he doesn't spawn or when he does when I mess up the skip Skater was a run killer that's also a run killer <laughs> dumb way to die all right let's that's load why I told uh, you to save it if you didn't save on. it shame on you okay yeah this is actually I think this is just before that is a dumb way to die for real fr I think this is just before Cowboy, and I think I got my pistols. No. Nope. No. No. Nope, none of those. What do I got in my inventory? Nothing. It's a glorious hole, isn't it? 
I thought I had a save just before Skater Boy, but I must have got rid of it. No. Really, no. I need to get rid of all these other saves. I don't need those. I'm basically just going to be in New Game Plus pretty much exclusively. I don't really need any uh, regular gameplay stuff anymore. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll pick it up from the start. We'll get a save going. Put it up at the top there before Skater Boy. We need to get these. We need to get these back three practiced here. They still don't fix black inventory screen. Nah, not yet. well. There hasn't been a patch yet. So once there's a patch, I'm hoping they fix that. I don't. I'm kind of uh, leaning toward well, if I want them to fix more of the crucial things when it comes to gameplay. Like that's not really crucial. That's just kind of a a visual. So let's grab our genitals. So even in classic, it's yeah. Even in classic, classic it's jackpot. They need to fix that Uzi clip glitch in the Great Pyramid. Absolutely. What a bunch of freaking. What a bunch of yahoos they are. Forget about that, man. Nah, that's good. It's alright. There always. There, honestly, there's always going to be bugs. We were actually talking about this. Um, uh, who was I talking with? I, oh, I remember what I was talking about. Anyway, um, I was talking about this with some people. And, uh, dude, they're always going to have glitches in games when the first release. It's just going to happen. There's always going to be glitches. And you know whose fault it's not? It's not the developer's fault. Really, honestly. It's not. They want to actually provide a decent product. They actually want it because, I mean, a decent product looks good on them, right? As developers, they look good. But the problem is, is the, uh, they, the executives like, oh, just you're only 80% complete? Exactly. Exactly. Just go. Just release the freaking thing. Oh, you're only 70%? Oh, there's some bugs? Okay, well, just release it. Let's so we can get it publicly, and then we can fix those later. It's always going to be that way nowadays. You can always expect every game that's ever going to release can have bugs. Now, I'm not saying it's right. I'm not saying it's uh, they shouldn't fix them. I'm just saying that we're, just expect it to be expected. Feel me? It's stuck in a wall. Yeah, that's from what uh, people have seen in Two Mei Ti. I haven't been able to run Two Mei Ti, but yeah. Hey, Maro, we're society. What's up? Is this possible to put all anniversary textures in this remaster so we can have a full uncut game with anniversary graphics? Um, I think that would be like a project because you have to change out a lot of assets. Anniversary isn't a cube like game and like it is in here. Of course, they could still take textures and put them in here and make it look like. But that would be a modder's job. What's up, everybody? Yeah, it's just a practice for now. We'll be doing runs later. I still keep forgetting to put her sunglasses on. That's That boat doesn't bode well for me. I imagine me getting to these later levels and forgetting the sunglasses. And just being like... Alright, guys, this is the end of the stream. I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep now. Defeated by my own thing. Hey, no.
Hey, Texas Toast, what is up? In the last little, yeah, Great Pyramid. <laughs> For getting it on at the very beginning of Great Pyramid. You're stoked to see Torso Guy? Oh, you haven't seen him yet. Oh, God. Oh, perfect. Okay, I can run into that wall. For a quick out. I keep forgetting that other fuse. What a forgetful little fuse. <laughs> Okay, yeah, let's get this secret. Let's get over get through cowboy get a save going for skater boy and try practicing the skip Try practicing killing him because that's what I really need practice on I really need to get practice on skipping him and I need to be prepared for the cases when I don't when I fail to skip Ain't nothing personal. <laughs> Why do I think that the Tomb Raider are masterpieces? Uh, because they're really well put together. Like, this is the game style in general, and then the, uh, the way that the tank controls work, and... Everything just works. To, this works so well. The game flows so so well once you understand how it's all put together. Um, the puzzles are very interesting. Yeah, I mean, even though I know them, you know, it doesn't really matter. They're still interesting, especially when I watch somebody new play. Whatever. All right. Well, if you don't want to know, I'll just shut up. What's up, Exo Cop? Am I doing a pistols only run? No, not pistols only. Pistols only on NG Plus is a nightmare. Yeah. I mean, honestly, a lot of the, sh the, sh the strats that I do, um, they're pretty cheesy. Like, they cheese the, the, bot the mobs. So, honestly, I could get away with pistols only, I think, but... It just takes so much time. It's just kind of a freaking. Ain't nothing personal. I don't know. It's just kind of dead. So I'm not really too interested in pistols only, but I can. I definitely see that as an increased challenge, and I do respect people who do it and put their effort into it for sure. Soul Reaver remastered. Oh my god, that would be amazing. I don't think Soul Reaver is popular enough though. Like Tomb Raider is really popular. It's got a cult following and all this other crap. So, but yeah, Soul Reaver is such a good game. Honestly, Tomb Raider and Soul Reaver were the the two games that I remember the most vivid from uh, PlayStation when I was younger. Well, also Metal Gear.
No, you're salad. If I don't kill Skater Boy, how do I grab the Uzis? The Uzis, you actually get them at the very beginning of Atlantis if you didn't get them from Skater Kid. Um, yeah. I believe the game also, if you didn't get, if you get to the end without getting the pistols, then the game gives you the pistols. And I'm pretty confident it's just one of, one other pickup where the uh, you get the magnum. So it's not it's nothing nothing major. Notice that two D objects are now three D. Yeah, the sprites the the one D sprites are now two dimensional or three dimensional. The two D sprites are now three. Yeah, so like this ammo for example is a two D sprite. Basically, just a two D image that always rotates so it faces the the um, faces the camera. But in nowadays they're three dimensional. It's a chalk, my chalk, and chalk, chalk. Oh, chalk! By the way, there was another command that I had made for you that I had forgotten about, um, and I I think I made it um, about the time when um, I left, so it's kind of unused. I think it was called give chalk dunks. Okay, there's a save crystal up here, so we can save just before Skater Kid Guy. We gotta save it so that we can uh, get some practice in on Skater Kid. Um, I made it here with almost all my life. We got what five percent missing? I think that fault is what took a little bit away. It's fine. All right, let's put this one at the very top. Now I have a save where I can do some practice here. So we gotta practice the skip, we gotta practice the kill as well. I don't know really how to do it perfectly. Well, that worked. All right. I think, honestly, I want to do this in regular graphics because the camera is a little bit different. When I tried it la yeah, last night, that camera was really jacking me up because of the angle it was at. The angle is slightly different. You can see between the two. Where the hell is he? I'm 
practice this for the Nolos Nomads. things that he shouldn't have done. This is a bummer, man. That's, uh, that's a bummer. Well, let's see if we can keep the skip up. I mean, I'm skipping them pretty consistently today, but... that you go on with him too. Like you gotta keep your radius wide just like him. And then when he goes away, I'm supposed to wait here. Damn. Damn, when he goes like that, it really... <sighs> Can't you just skip him? Yeah, I've said like five times already that you can skip him. I'm trying to practice the skip, and I also need to make sure that I can kill him when I fail the skip. All right, I need to make sure that it works both ways. I need to be able to be, do it both ways. I didn't skip him that time. See, that's uh, <laughs> this would have been a time. Imagine now me going through Nolos no meds at this point and not have any practice on him whatsoever when he breaks free. That's what we're doing here. There we go. That's what we were looking for. Just keep, just keep that angle wide, right? That's the key. You stay behind him, you gotta keep your angle wide. You don't want to try to curve in and try to cut him off. You want to try to stay literally kind of keep your angle wide, I feel. Okay, cool. I feel like... All right. I need to understand what I'm really doing there to s cause a skip. He skipped. Yeah, I mean, he skipped now. All right. I'm glad that that I'm hitting it, but I hope that I can do that during a run. Okay, let's go. Let's practice the kill then. Punch him into the lava. Oh, I wish. Putting an ash of war on my shotgun and just blow him off into the lava. Oh, oh, he's closing in. He's closing that gap. I need to keep my my rain radius wide. Keep the radius wide. That's the that's the key here, guys. And when he goes off, oh. Sometimes you have to roll when those situations occur, but not bad. I mean, shoot, clearly better to not take damage. He will melt you if you don't. He will melt you. Melt. That was Completely destroy. Close. You were almost a Jill sandwich. Skater Kid is a penetrator on NG Plus, by it, guys. Just saying. Skaterway's called Jerome. This is a hard level to know, but it is. A successful, nice. successful skip again.
Ain't nobody else here. You oh, must snap. be firing at me. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. Okay. Well, whatever. Looks like we're gonna get the secret. Maybe I can finish him off later. You firing at me? Huh? Ain't oh. nobody else here. You must be firing at me. Oh, I hope to God it's on loop. It's not on loop. Damn it. Okay, I kind of want to go back to where I was. Whoa. Bring it down. I mean, bring it on. Bring it on down. He's only like two shots away. All right. Vroom, vroom, vroom. That's really the hardest part in the in this. That and hopefully hope, hoping you get through Cowboy. Let's do. Um, let's go to Atlantis. I forgot the freaking glasses. <laughs> What's up, everybody? What's up, Hellsmith? Doing shotgun guy, pistols only, no meds is a nightmare. Yeah, I, I believe it. I don't think there's anywhere you can actually stand and snipe him. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Where'd he go? He must be coming up here. You can actually skip this guy if you do it correctly. I didn't do it correctly, so I had to kill him. I should be able to avoid that guy, too. I would do the safe, the safe way. You don't have to do the false grab. That's just if you want to look cool. Now, Atlantis is going to be a tough level to get through Nomad for sure. There's, uh, I think, honestly, Atlas Mines and the Great Pyramid, though, are the, the kings of the run, though. I think with all the skips we know for this one and all the cheese we know, it's pretty easy.
This is just practice. I wish I was in an official attempt. Time to die. Oh, I hope not. So I can make the door. Oh, bastards! Freaking A, man. Hey, Juchi, what's up? You have finally have time to come in my tier stream again. Yeah, that's awesome. Welcome, bummer, man. Bringing some Germany, Marvelinas. What's up, Marvelinas? Love to see Soul Reaver. Yeah, we talk about Soul Reaver. Man, you freaking game. I hate you. Watch, I'm not going to make the timer now. Hate this game. I'm done with it. Put it down forever. Son of a man, I hate you. <laughs> hate this. Alt F4, undelete, or uninstall. Oh, you had that at the glitch. That was where the the slope is. That's where you had the glitch. Oh, I see. Clang Clang doors the most. They're my favorite ones. Because if you know about them, then they're not really that threatening because you just run through whatever. But, um, oh god, whoa, what the? But if you don't know about them, you go through the door, you might actually like hop back on accident and freaking get hit by it. Oh, wait, I don't need to pull this over. That was ridiculous. Let's not pull levers I don't need to, even though I've killed already everything that I don't really need to kill in here. That's cool. That's cool, man. I like it. Oh, God. 
back in the water. Easy. Easy. Easy money. Do any of the Flappy Nuts guys shoot? Yeah. This guy's oh, oh that guy sucks by the way. I think this is the way to do this guy now that now that I'm sitting here freaking doing it. Unless he escapes from the ceiling. But like jumping back and forth here, I think because the platforms are different height, he was not able to walk over him, so he has to fly, which puts him in a flying animation, which gives you plenty of time to shoot at him. Can we please get out of the scene? Missed. Could you imagine this pistols only? Come on now. It's just, it's just. No, oh, man. Currently practice. Yeah, we're going to be doing some runs a little bit later. Goodness.
Pestles only might be. Oh, it's possible. It's just annoying. It's just super annoying and long winded. But it still would take a lot of patience and, and skill to do pistols only, so. It's a fair challenge, in my opinion. No pistols? That's possible. I would imagine it's possible. I don't think it's possible to do all kills, no pistols, but... But yeah, that would actually make it um, an interesting challenge early on. Because you kind of have to figure out like where you can use your ammo. But after like the first two levels, you've, you've stocked up on so much ammo that like it doesn't really matter much. Okay, this is also a contentious part if we like, these guys don't behave properly. behaved for the most part there was one that I was expecting to shoot meatballs but he was shooting darts so <clears throat> now this mines would be a challenge of no pistols run if you do all your skips it wouldn't on a no pistols run uh, actually not really because you can go and grab the shotgun as well um, yeah I, it's possible, but yeah, it'd be a little bit more intricate because it'd be a little bit more difficult for sure because of because you have to go get the shotgun first. I'm assuming you actually want to go kill the enemies, but you can honestly beat that level without killing any enemies. So no pistols, you could easily get away with. Them. But yeah. <laughs> oh, you know how there's not supposed to be any med packs in NG Plus. Well, what the hell is that thing? They freaking lied to us. <laughs> what am I drinking? I am drinking tears of punched babies. How dare you? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Uzis and Tomb Raider 1, you got to, uh, they're in Sanctuary Skion's the earliest so you can get them. They're, um, on a hidden, they're on an invisible platform above the Sphinx's left shoulder. That's why I told you to save it. I SAVED IT! Actually, we can skip this whole thing too. I don't know, I don't know how I should feel about this skip that I'll show you guys that I know about. It's kind of buggy, but at the same time, it's like, well, I mean, honestly, there's times when we use this mechanic. So, how do I do this? It's, uh, oh, you stand here, and then you get up against this block, you pull up, and then you immediately hold jump and left. And then she'll get up in here, and you can go pull the lever without having to go through the trap room. But, anyway. 
Ah, yes. Ah, yes. My favorite room. <laughs> Thanks, Amanda Edwards. <laughs> Can you do me a favor and use the photo mode on the last level of the game? There's a part of it where just one breakaway tile lets you just fall in just a square of water. Could you use the photo mode to see what's the entrance ahead? Yeah, let's talk. Let, we'll, you have to remind me, but yeah, let's see about it. We can look at it. Okay, so that's the trigger tile to show. Maybe we can skip that. Somebody was mentioning. All right, Atlantean time. Can't take any more meatballs to the face. No more balls to the face, guys. Please. Whatever you do, don't jump and don't step on the red tile. That was too close. You were almost a general sandwich. No, 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 no! Mistakes were made. We don't even need to kill these Atlanteans, man. They don't shoot at you. So if you do all this right, you never have to go down there and touch them. This Atl this um lantern here can tax you hard too. What's up, everybody? Typically, take a meatball in the face if he doesn't bug out and shoot the ceiling. Probably screwed. sure who came up with that one that's a good strat left first so we're gonna go right right is the right way right then right right is right well there you go that's um Oh, I don't need those. I don't need them. Just go. That's Atlantis NG plus no meded. Now we just gotta make sure we can do that during the middle of a run. that I'm too uh, concerned about Atlantis. I think Atlantis will be fine. I think Great Pyramid and Natalie's Mines are going to be the most challenging ones of the run. Alright, let's do some Great Pyramid. Oh, uh, here's a uh, torso guy in HD.
those fingers, buddy. Only one hit. There it is. When do you expect my walkthroughs on YouTube? Sometime this month. We're going to be getting some stuff out this month. I've totally changed your mind. Dude, I was the same way. Somebody told me about the shotgun um, on Torso Guy. I thought it was Uzi's, but shotgun's got the highest DPS for sure. And you can honestly listen to the music to prove that point too. Pretty OP weapon for sure. I think it, I don't even, I honestly don't think it's even OP. It's just it's just strong. Like it's a really good weapon. <laughs> I like how it's it's also differentiates itself from the other weapons because it's more of a short range, heavy black heavy hit weapon, whereas the other weapons are good for range. Yo, that was close. Level 12, you see invisible floor contacting Uzis, you'll find it. It'd be awesome if you can jump and pull yourself up to that crack. So this is also the boulder part where they kind of set some precedent that you can jump through the boulders. So I don't necessarily consider jumping through the boulders to be a glitch because of this. I'll show it. Or is, I don't know if it's here or where exactly it was at. Crap. There's a trick to get down there, no damage, but to me, that's it's just too glitchy. Well, that didn't work. 
work that time. Oh, that's because it's the one I get hit by anyway. There we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Getting hit by only one dart, baby. Yeah. Don't probably don't need these. <laughs> Hard to skip those. Yeah, we have figured out how to get to uh, get it down to one one dart. I haven't figured out how to pass that one dart, but everything else I can avoid easily. Well, not easily. There's, yeah. I don't want to. So the first dart you can skip by just jumping past it. The second dart is pretty much the one that I think you're required to get hit by at least once. The second, or the third and the fourth darts are skippable by the shimmy. Oh, oh, get away from that lava. <laughs> yeah, here's the here's where they set the precedent right here with these shotgun shells. You can jump o over the bullet. Now granted there's no ceiling up there, but get hit by that axe until today until today never ever ever well i think maybe i got hit by it once when i was making the walkthrough <clears throat> but i've always been able to bypass that axe <laughs> oh man good stuff anyway <clears throat> okay i think i'm i think i've got enough practice here man i think i'm ready to go but i'm gonna take a break we're gonna get started here shortly Go grab your beverages, go grab your foods, go grab your genitals, and uh, be back here, I don't know, in about five minutes, and we will start to do this thing with the stuff, with our clothes on. Uh, I feel like this needs to be said some, for some people. Came. I'm not the weird one, they are. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyway. I shall return shortly, BRB. Never. 
Brother Chen Bakeng. Oh snap, my coffee! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, I'm back. Oh, we shall begin. Let's hope that... Oh, you know what I should honestly do is, uh... Go, no, we should do. I was gonna say we should do St. Francis Folly and I should get through the Thor place, but honestly, I just need to get my head on my ass on that one. All right, we're starting it up, guys. Here we go. Some attempts. Ready, go. New game plus. No loads, no meds, all secrets, always sunglasses, T Rex lives. <laughs> It's time to do some nerdy stuff. Why am I not diving on St. France? Say what? <laughs> Sick transit Amanda, what's up? <laughs> you had a slice of cake because that's what you do at 8.30 p.m.? I think most would agree. <laughs> Jump diving in the Thor room in St. Francis. Yeah, you can do that. That's one strategy. There's honestly, if you time it right, you just don't even need to do that. You just jump properly, but I've been failing it and I should probably just do the dive. <laughs> I'll smack my head against the wall. kind of cake we talking about I think pound cake right 
having a slice of pound cake. Are you devouring the pound cake? No St. Francis folly slip ups. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. I think yesterday was just a bad tomb raiding day, so they happen, dude. <clears throat> Some days are just better than others. Pound cake for all. Just saying, this ain't the run, you can feel it. Oh my gosh, Bisanka, how dare you! <laughs> Alright, if I fail, it's her fault. It's just all there is to it. <sighs> Good job signing yourself up for that blame. That's caves, so. Cité of Vilclebemba. You're on it. Where's this guy going? Where's they going? What? Going, gross. All right, we'll worry about the bats later. Here's my feeling it's going to be good. No, no, you got to be negative to bring positive. Oh, yeah, that's true. The yin and the yang. You can't have the good without the bad. I see. Are you winning, son? What's up, Phil? Uh, we are um, just starting, really. I definitely wouldn't say I'm winning. <laughs> I'll feel like I'm winning when I get through St. Francis Folly. And then even more so after I get through City of uh, Kamun. Then I'll feel it. Thank you. 
You're guessing spike death? Whoa! You have such little faith in me, you think I'm gonna die to a spike trap? I mean, honestly, you might be right. Uh, exclamation point survey, by the way. There is a survey on how many attempts you think it's gonna take me. Um, the poll closes today. We're assuming that today is not the day, but... What do you win if you get it right? Well, I don't know. I have to talk to Dom. He's the one administering. <laughs> I don't have the gift. should be a small there should be like a five second delay between when you send a message and when it shows up in stream or somewhere around there wonder if nigel will cooperate today too hopefully we're nice to nigel these days i don't understand why he's so why he's complaining so much for Nigel and Nigel only. <laughs> Come on, Matt. No, don't come on me. Uh, don't be so harsh on Nigel. The guy hasn't been the same since he discovered he was adopted and not blood related to Velociraptors. <clears throat> hey, man, we're all we're all part of the same large family at the end of the day, man. <laughs> Nigel's my brother or sister. I'm not sure. He didn't tell me. Hey, you know uh, that there's a trophy for all items in this game? Yeah, but Atlantis, yeah, I'm aware of that one. We're waiting for a patch for, to, uh, uh, for that to be fixed.
Oh, oh, I thought I was at the wrong angle. Oh. We need to name this guy. You name him Barry. Barry the brown bear. Hey, Barry, come on, brother. Barry. Billy. Oh, God. Okay, well, at least I got a lock on him. My creativity knows no bounds. Nope. <laughs> Unlimited. Uncapped. Billy Berry, Brown Bear. And Bill the Shotgun. <laughs> Yeah, because he's always yeah he's built a shotgun because he's uh always writing checks that I can't cash with him. God, he's not paying the bill. Billy Bear Burton, Burton. He dead, bro. Do I remember you also? Um, Clint Drakwa. No, I'm like, sorry, I don't actually. I'm very sorry. Oh, whoops, CDs. So if this one is Barry, are the other ones bears, Larry and Harry? Sure. That's pretty good. Larry, Harry, and Barry. I think Harry fits really well. Larry, I want, what can we do with... Well, Harry and Barry are good, though, for bear, bear names, for sure. But I rarely even, I rarely even see them, so... The other two bears, I don't even interact with one of them. The other one, I completely... Yeah, I also don't interact with them at all. So it's really just Barry. He's the only popular one. Curly, yeah. How about Rory? Oh, Rory. Rory would be a good name for a bear. Rory, Harry, and Barry. <laughs> Excuse me. Nigel, time for a snack. Let's, no, let's not help the air so much today, guy. We don't need, we got kids around here, man. We got kids watching.
You think Jeff is old enough to have the talk? Oh, okay. Well, then never mind. Nigel, hump away. Damn it, Nigel. Of course we gotta come out to you doing this. Maybe it's best to just honestly leave through this door and just get rid of them so that way you can go grab the secrets. That might be the best thing to do. Changing the routing up a bit here. Nigel. Go hut thrust those hips somewhere else, my friend. We are not interested in that kind of uh, must be a activity. Somewhere. Nigel's looking for it. Bro. Those hips don't lie. Yeah, you got a destiny over there. There you go. Yeah. Nigel. Nigel, I need you to go and, uh, yeah, not that way. That's a bad way. I need you to go, you know, your destiny is that way, my friend. Don't look at me. Just run away. Nigel, there. Oh, he's gonna fart on me. I think he just tried to rocket propel some turds into my face. R Nigel! Nigel, my god. There you go, buddy. Yeah, there you go. Your destiny's down that way, my friend. news no Nigel's having none of it. Yeah, he's like, I, I don't care. I'm here to tax you. That's my job. I'm the T-Rex. <laughs> I am the tax man. <laughs> Nigel always up in here to tax. some of a horror game i don't care yeah it honestly it, it somewhat yeah i agree with you to some degree because i mean it's all about the jump scares and the the wild crap i want to kill these raptors for when i leave leave a little snack for for nigel Nigel, my man, don't you dare knock me off like that again. You stay away. Go. I'm making snacks for you. This guy, bro.
Hey, Klinjaquas, do you know that there's a trophy for all items in this game, but Atlantis, you cannot get the last item because it's bugged. Do you have any ideas? Uh, we don't have any at the time. We basically are just waiting as a community for them to provide a patch. Whoa, that was a mistake. A lot of life loss, but it'll be fine. We're fine, guys. Relax, relax, buddy. Nigel's upset. I don't think he likes the food I left for him. Well, too bad, man. We don't have very many options around here. You know, we live in kind of a rural area. You live in kind of a rural area, there's not many options, so you're gonna have to live with the you're gonna have to live with the, the last raptor. So gotta get the break off floor tiles trophy. I still gotta get that one too, man. Those kind of tr trophies really freak me out because it's like, if you miss just one, <laughs> and you're like, where? Which level was it, man? I did miss the big waterfall secret. You're right. You're right. You're right. I didn't get it. I did skip it. I should have two of five. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to go deal with Nigel again then. Sag. Let's get the up here taken care of, then we'll go down there and deal with that. It's sad you can't get the last trophy now. Yeah, we're all kind of upset about it. We just gotta wait. Honestly, just wait. We'll get it eventually. I think they'll have this patched out. Um, it hasn't even been a month since release, so we still got some time. Does the DLC also have an NG Plus? Not that I'm aware of. I think that the um, the DLC in this is just regular. But honestly, the DLC itself is pretty ridiculously tough. Those levels are off the scales when it comes to... They're like tier LE levels. By the way, for those of you who like Tomb Raider, like... You guys should honestly check out tier LE if you like the classic Tomb Raider style. Tier LE is freaking phenomenal. It's like custom maps and stuff. And honestly, they're usually better than classic Tomb Raiders. Almost missed it. That would have been bad. Bird. All right, so we have four or five. We gotta go get the fifth one. You're scared to start a tier three all secrets one. Can you also do a walkthrough in remaster? Yeah, that's the plan. We'll be getting one for us. All right, this part's gonna suck because I don't know where Nigel's at. Oh God. Oh my goodness, Nigel, my my good man. Oh, he's over right where I need to be. Oh God, oh God, no, 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 no. Whoa. Nigel. 
Get lost. <laughs> Almost became a snack. You're still drawing, Matt? If you need anything, I got it. Oh, nice. There's Nigel. There's good old Nigel. Can I, uh, is there like a, can I get off on the slope over here? No? Yeah. <laughs> Where is he? Ah, see, he was hiding over there, waiting for me. <laughs> Nigel, you have a destiny, and it's over there. Not that way, no, this, that, my God, Nigel. All right, fine. Fine. Oh, my God, he's right on me. All right, we have everything. We're ready to complete the level. We just don't just need to not die. It's What's up, everybody? Important. This is the important thing here. I don't know a good way of getting down from this side. I've never tried, actually. Never tried, actually. I'll just, I'll just do it the way I know, then. Heal. All right, well, give me a med pack. Tell you what, if I find a med pack, I'll heal, okay? If I pick one up, I will heal with it. How's that sound? N Nigel, my, my good friend, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're a good man. With a temper. was close <laughs> that was a little too close I've had a lot of close calls today in Lost Valley that was too close you were almost a jiggle sandwich almost goodbye Benny You all need to change your pants. Whoop. All right, to McQualapec, always sunglasses. T-Rex is already alive, so. I think the coolest part of this run is the always sunglasses part, man, honestly.
Good thing that's a zero risk trick jump. Is that Will Ferrell? No, that's actually uh, Bring Sessing. That's actually Barry Burton from Resident Evil. Resident Evil 1 Jill campaign. You're right. Why don't I separate the challenge by levels? Because that would just be too simplistic. I mean, I want to be able to, we should be able to go from the start to the finish of the game. That's the entire point. So I wouldn't want to split it out. I might do that for practicing, but for like a challenge run, no, you gotta do, you gotta do it from the start to the, from the very beginning to the very end. No breaks, no deaths, none of that. Well, you can take a break, but I mean like... No reloading. No saving. You can't save either because otherwise you heal. Well, at least at a crystal. This shotgun is amazing! Hell yeah. You blame me? Man, I would definitely watch your trophy run. Oh yeah. What's my favorite Resident Evil game? I like Resident Evil 3, I think. Uh, Resident Evil 2 is really good too, but I really haven't played much of the modern Resident Evil. I think the remakes are pretty good too. The remakes are phenomenal. Hey, Sarah Queen, what's up? By the way, for no med pack, run level skip works. Oh, you can just level like level skip your way to the end. I thought they made it so that way trophies were disabled if you did if you enabled or if you did cheats like that. I guess they didn't. What system are you playing on? Cleanser Quas. Resident Evil 3 remake was a letdown? Oh no. How many of you guys think Resident Evil 3 was a letdown? Matt, there's some one game you played before you left that was a guy on a lab with a dark lab. And there were plants and fungus or something. And there was zombies or plant zombies or something that what was that game that was Resident Evil that was Resident Evil remake Resident Evil 3 remake was weaker than Resident Evil 2 remake Because they rushed it right out the door It was originally supposed to be a DLC for Resident Evil 2 Remake. Whoa, that seems strange. Have I got a favorite Resident Evil villain? Um, I freaking, I don't know. I think I love Nemesis. Dude's like a smart zombie.
You have a plushie of Nemesis? <laughs> What is my favorite Assassin's Creed game? Uh, I think Assassin's Creed 2 is really good. I haven't really played all of them, so I really can't speak on all of them, but the ones I have played, Resident Evil 2 really stands out, or Assassin's Creed 2 really stands out. He don't say stars. Nemesis doesn't say stars. What does he say then? Stairs. I gotta take the stairs. <laughs> your question may be weird, but what is your, your boss enemy throughout the tier games? I mean, the one that you enjoy killing the most. Hmm. Honestly, the snake heads in TR5 are a really cool mechanic. You have my total attention now. They're not really a boss because they're kind of easy once you know what to do, but hey, we're in St. Francis Folly. Hopefully St. Francis Folly doesn't turn into Badass Games Folly today. You could do some sort of damage against set, kind of like how you fight Willard. Oh, okay. Yeah, Tomb Raider 4 um, set is kind of a, one of those bosses where it's like, man, really? Like, I just can't even fight him. I have to lock him away. Like, I want to kill this guy so he doesn't come back. You know, that's kind of what goes through my head. St. Francis. Faily. Oh, oh. EDO skip successful, yeah. Hey dude, used to watch your vids back in the day. Glad you're back playing TR3 and you can't uh, platinum that either. Can't get zipline trophy without all's hollows. Yeah, that's true. Um, thankfully you can cheese the collecting of all of them. It's impossible to do them in Duba Gorge having different paths. Cheese the crystals. Yeah, there's a few uh, flaws in the logic of some of these um, trophies, but well, they'll get. I, f I feel like they'll get it straightened out. I don't think we have anything to worry about at this moment, except that we can't do them right now. Is this an all pickups run? No, it's not an all pickups run. What's up, Comod and Cam? Thanks for swinging by. You stream both on YouTube and Twitch? Yeah, I'm streaming on YouTube and Twitch right now, both. Uh, the, the chat below is Twitch only currently. I'm working on trying to get in that to include YouTube, so. So the bonus level in tier three is bugged. Yeah, we can't unlock it. I, I got all the secrets and I didn't unlock for me and a lot of people are reporting the same thing. So right now we can't do all hollows. Had some ice cream that was 11 out of 10. What? That breaks math. Mama Khan had ice cream so good it broke math. 
Really? Wow. Yeah, it's kind of a kind of you know, it sucks, but hopefully they're working on a patch to fix it. Hey, do not put your mouth on me. Get your gator mouth away from me. Gotta go now? Oh, Amicia, all right. No kills? Oh, we're not, it's not no kills. It's just the stre the uh, challenge is no saving, basically. New game plus, always sunglasses, T-Rex lives. Those are the only stipulations. So I can use whatever weapons I can use. Yeah, just can't save. You couldn't do that? Well, I'm sure if you try and practice, you get to it. There's a lot of people that do no lozo meds in these days. Plus, we got cheese strats. We got, I mean, I'm not. Honestly, a lot of the stuff that would normally kill somebody, I just cheese it. That's basically what it comes down to. <laughs> you know, all the hard stuff, you just cheese it. There's a few things you can't cheese that you're going to need some skill, but. Like the platforming, you really can't cheese the platforming. But when it comes to platforming, you just got to be a decent Tomb Raider in order to get around effectively. Fun fact, I started a gaming YouTube channel in 2015. I also played TR because I made you miss the game. <laughs> I see. I don't intend on making people do everything. So far you put 66 six hours in tier 3 and haven't e even roughly touched tier 1 and 2. Your guides really helped me with the secrets. Forgot about them. Oh man. Good to see you back. Love the explosion series. Thank you so much, Comedin. Yeah, explosions is one of my favorite for sure. I like I love explosions. I really wish I mean, I really wish I would play them now, but at the same time, man, these remasters are just so good. And we have to do a no loads, no meds challenge right now, man. I can't let this go by the wayside here. Hey, now, Laura. Imagine if Last Revelation and Chronicles get remastered as well. Yeah, exactly. We're, I think they are working on that. If these sell well, they will, for sure, like uh, Sarah's saying. Why that didn't include a... An achievement for Swan Diving Lara off the Sphinx, I'll never know. Always a fan favorite, yeah. Almost like locking Winston in the freezer. You gotta dive from the Great Pyramid, though. That's the longest. That's the highest. chicken strat here because chicken strat is safe strat you're on temple of shion in two nice that's a beautiful level they really made that one look that's pretty good too done.
On that live stream with the developers, they said the funniest thing they noticed is how many people enjoy killing Lara in every possible... Yeah, <laughs> it's so fun. Honestly, that's one of the things that stuck out to me when I first played Tomb Raider was like, dude, they literally like have her being impaled by spikes and they got this torso guy tossing her around like a rag doll. It's freaking phenomenal. I think the only cool thing that really happens in something like Resident Evil is you get decapitated. Remember watching my original No Lows No Meds run? Yeah, that was fun. Good stuff. A snowmobile in TR2? Yeah, dude. Ow, damn oh, please, I swear to Time God. To die. You watch. Do not run with scissors or swords. Okay, we just got Pierre left. Oh, I still got Thor room. I always. I've been forgetting this for some reason. Maybe because it's the bane of my existence here. Damn it, son. This has been the bane. For whatever reason, I keep, I keep dying to this electricity here, which is very odd. It never really happens to me. All right, what's going to be... Well, let's take it carefully here. So you can carefully walk up to the second tile here. For those of you who have issues with this. You can get as close to that second tile as you possibly can. And then wait for the, the lightning bolt to go and then just do a run, jump, and dive. It works really well. It's pretty consistent. <clears throat> I'm talented for no med pack run. I hope so. It's kind of why I play it. I love the thrill of getting later in the game and everybody sh is shitting their pants whenever I do a jump wrong. It's one of my favorite parts. I wonder if you can do a half tile there. Pick up the ammo, half tile that. I'm not in the mood or in the mode to do experiments like that though. I'm in the middle of a no a run, so. And then for the way back, it's basically the same thing, but you can only go one tile for this. He's freaking melting me right now. All right, we're gonna use him. Magnum bomb deck. This is bad. This is super bad. And I have to die that way as well too. Oh my god, guys! I can't believe this level. This level hates me. Unbelievable. Uh, level is cursed. It's cursed. It's official. It's, honestly, every single time I've died, it's been to something dumb. But hey, you know what? That's part of the that's part of the no loads, no meds. I guess we're gonna be doing another attempt. So don't go anywhere. Uh, please give me a few minutes. I'm gonna take a break. When I come back, we're gonna do another attempt. So many dumb ways to die. All right, I'll be right back, guys. Brother Chen Barking.
Look at all you suckers. <clears throat> be right back. I mean, I'm back. Not be right back. I am back. <sighs> From the top, ladies and gentlemen. GG as always. Yeah, we gotta get further though. We want we need to get to the levels where the anxiety really spikes in people, man. That's what really makes these no lows, no meds runs fun. You know, when we're rolling around in Atlas Mines. <laughs> the entire goal here is to get your anxiety as high as possible, and that works often. Atlantis will be fun. I honestly don't think Atlantis is that bad if things go well. But honestly, I guess I could be sell it said for any level, but how, how can I uh, clarify that? Hmm. If the enemies, if they shoot into the walls like you expect, honestly, uh, Atlantis isn't that hard. And you just gotta know a little bit about the dodging and stuff, but. Natlas Mines with Skater Kid. The Skater Kid part is the worst. And then the Great Pyramid because of the dart trap now. Dying to Boulders would be fun as well. <laughs> yeah, that would be... Uh... I, you know what would be hilarious? If one day... I'm Okay, I'm sitting here doing no loads, no meds. And then I die. And then on the lower right hand corner of my screen, I get the uh, the trophy for finding all the ways to kill Lara. I don't think we're gonna get an AOD remaster. That game is just way too broken. I love the optimism though in the community. If they did, they would have to make it from the ground up. Yeah, for the most part. Or they could just like, yeah, there couldn't really be a remake or a remaster of AOD. They would kind of have to really dig into the stuff in order to make it better. But I mean, they should, they should. I think they should. Cause AOD is actually really fun. It's got a good story. Um, yeah. That sweet secret sound, it only sucks when it kills music, though. It's like, hello, I'm here to kill the music you're listening to. And you're like, oh, you freaking secret. What a downer. Hey. Done. And 
Did we get under four? Under five? 446. Good to go. Good to go. Good to go. All right. What was my time in city? Hopefully these wolves don't run around the freaking country. We're going to see he's going to go run around the country. One more. Oh no, mas. Come at. Oh, there you are. Okay, cool. Peace out. <laughs> Tomb Raider is a Dark Souls platform. I can't believe it took me so long to realize. I actually came to that conclusion pretty recently too, man. You're not alone. But yeah, I was saying that honestly, this is a. Uh, you know, the modern Tomb Raider of the 2013 series, they've been chasing that Uncharted IP and playing some Dark Souls. If they, they should chase the Dark Souls style IP. I've been saying this for a little bit. I think the remasters, if they sell well and people actually, their people are actually receptive to them and, you know, them actually being classics and stuff, maybe people will realize just how pretty cool these games are. But I think a lot, I know a lot of people in the U.S., they actually, it's not very popular in the U.S., honestly, Tomb Raider. I know there's a lot of people who have heard of it in the U.S., but it's still not popular. I think it's the worst on the top 15 countries that where this is selling is US is the 15th something like that You want a physical version? Yeah, that'd be nice. Honestly, I think that they don't view, I think that they do not view the classics as, they just don't see it worthy, I guess. But I mean, honestly, given the remaster, this amazing remaster, I mean, they clearly see it's worthy of something as good as this. You like the modern trilogy yeah it's just different i think the modern trilogy is just fine for it being a game a triple a game they can call it a triple a game it's just not tomb raider it's not like this it doesn't feel like this it doesn't see it just doesn't ring the same bells that this game does all they did was slap labels on it if it feels just to sell it to the fans so it literally feels like a, it just feels like a cop-out so i have nothing wrong with the games i think they're cool I think they're fun. They'd probably be real fun to go through and um, to do the stuff, but I feel like they kind of, yeah, they just didn't. They just didn't nail what Tomb Raider is all about. They didn't and nail the essence of what Tomb Raider is. And it's strange because the modern controls in this make it feel like that's what modern Tomb Raider should be like. Like it feels like this is literally what it should be like. Maybe you know, fix the blockiness and the grittiness and all that stuff get rid of the grid whatever but the modern controls made it feel like if they actually evolved it like that's what it would feel like man whoa Classics won't, uh, the remasters won't touch the sales and modern ones, unfortunately, smaller on it. Yeah, I think that's, that's kind of what I would, was imagining too, but hey, we got them. So, okay. Wish the shotgun would freaking work. 
There you go. Put it right in his face. Blow it right in his face. In his face. There you go. Perfect. Classics are far better. Could they not put Tier Lee on console? I don't know. They could put tier leads on the console if they want to. Yeah, they could. Honestly, with some of the stuff I see coming out of YouTube, I mean, anybody could probably do it. <laughs> I wouldn't know how to do anything like that. Somebody else, I mean, third party could figure that out, I feel. Like, did you guys see that? The, the, I saw a video, it was a, the N uh, N64 port for Portal. And it was basically as if it, Portal was just downgraded in graphics. It ba basically was the same game. It was pretty crazy. Um, I don't know about the full game, but for the most part, it was uh, convincing. came across my YouTube channel at the start of COVID and that's how you found TRLE and my your mind was blown. Yeah, I didn't know they exist. I didn't know either. <clears throat> I remember when I first heard them, I was kind of skeptical, but then I tried them out. It's like, whoa, this is actually really fun. Like, it's just like as if classic Tomb Raider never ended and they continuously made classic Tomb Raiders, <laughs> you know, it's just what it is. And honestly, there's a lot more, I can tell people, there's a lot more love put behind these TRLEs because they're made by people who really aren't backed by some corporate guy that are being rushed to get something out. So, they're usually larger, longer, they have a lot more intricate puzzles, a lot more intricate jumping required. It teaches you a lot of skills and a lot of uh, mechanics about the game and how it works. TRLE is a PC version only, yeah. Recently platinum all three Dark Souls games, and man, you can't get a strange feeling when you go back to playing the other games. Oh, well, the new Tomb Raider follows the original roots, kicking my ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I also love Dark Souls and Elden Ring, and I've been... Um, I'm actually recently uh, a new player to them as well. Uh, I started playing Dark Souls in 2020. Um, played Dark Souls 1, and then... Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls, that's when I, and then that's when I left, I was gone for two and a half years. Almost, I think, yeah, almost three years. And then uh, came back, played Dark Souls 3, so I played Dark Souls 3 this year. For the first time. And Elden Ring I'm in the middle of. And I freaking, those games are so good, bro, oh my god! I'm gonna have to make some content with those. Original Halo trilogy trilogy. I don't I never really got into Halo. I never I did I didn't have a What was Halo on? They were on Xbox. I didn't have an Xbox. It's time for Barry to die. Barry the Brown Bear is banished. Barry the brown bear has been banished. Believe me, boys, Barry the brown bear has been banished. Let's see how, how long we can get, how long can we get it to go?
Imagine a bundle collection of the best tier elite levels on console. I think that what they should do is, um, re you know, when they finally remaster, uh, if if they're remastering Tomb Raider four and five, they should drop it at a level editor. Like drop an HD level editor. If it, honestly, if they don't like this this style of game, fine. Then just let the public do what they want with it. That way, I mean, if you're not gonna if you're not gonna run with it, then let the public do it. That way you don't have to waste your time with it. You can go chase whatever IP you want and we'll just go over here and not play your games. <laughs> uh. oh. Imagine you making levels on stream and stuff. There are people that do that. Agent XP does, she builds levels on stream. DJ Full, I think he, I'm not sure if he's really building much, but he streams, he's behind a lot of tier elites. Oh god. That's the first time I've ever seen him that close. Interesting. That is wishful thinking? Yeah, it is. Well, they released the tools when they released Chronicles. But yeah, it is wishful thinking. I was hoping they would release one for this, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Let's not jump to conclusions. wants to play. The tier 4 and tier 5 have additional contact and extra levels. There was a, a time times exclusive for tier 4. It's one level. I don't think TR5 had any though. Okay. Nigel's out here misbehaving again. <laughs> Seven dunks, that's right.
Is Nigel gonna let me leave this way? I hope so, man. He's he's been pretty mean about this hole. He's like, this is my hole. I think that's what roar means. Oh god, see, and you can see he's trying to act it out. He's trying to tell me. Yep. Nigel, my friend, we've had this discussion many times, sir. It's no time to talk, it's time to run. Thank you. Nigel! Yes. Yes. That's right. Perfect. Sorry, Nigel, I didn't mean to hit you that hard. But yeah, you're doing the right thing now, sir. Anyway, regardless. Actually, let's uh, beat him up. Let's not run over the edge. So sometimes I, I forget to hold walk when I press forward, and that is the reason why I think I died the last time. And that sucks when that happens. Honestly, anytime you fail in two minutes, it's honestly your fault, man. The cold controls are too consistent to determine anything otherwise. There's a little bit of RNG here and there. It comes to enemies. But when it comes to platforming, no, bro. You, you suck. Get better. <laughs> New players can't really complain anymore about how hard the puzzles are when you can just use a photo mode. Yeah, that's that and uh, action indicators. Like, those action indicators are huge. Like, oh wow, oh, the, oh, this is a movable block right here in the wall that I can barely see, but now I can see it because I got an exclamation point in my face. I like that Nigel's way over there, man. That's nice of him. Nice Nigel. Nigel the nice. So new games are impossible without guys. Well, that same could be said for older games too. Honestly, like Legend of Zelda. You wouldn't be able to beat the original Legend of Zelda without a guide. I'm sorry. <laughs> Unless you have like a million hours to spare. <laughs> hey, Nigel, my, man, Nigel, 
I need you to I need you to go down on that way, please. Your destiny is that way. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Yeah. Have a good one. No, N Nigel, what the what if we just we just had this, this there you go. Yes. Yes. Okay. I wonder if you could figure out like his pathing AI there. Nigel just wants to be friends. I don't want to be friends with his, his dude. He doesn't know how to play with friends correctly. He thinks that biting them is friendship. Nah, bro. Whoa! I did not mean to do that. I just wanted to get up onto this thing. I think if I need to, if I want to legitify this, I need to uh, get back down in here. There we Ooh, thought I was too far to the right. Good thing. Not that it would have mattered, fortunately. It's okay to fall in the water. It just sucks. So dumb we can't get platinum for each game on ps5 if they released these games like the mgs master collection then we wouldn't have we wouldn't have them yeah i don't know how the result that one use nintendo power yeah well, that's what I will. Nintendo Power is still a guide, you know? Now we're playing with power. Now we're playing with ass. <laughs> Anybody an ABGN fan? Nintendo Hotline, yeah. I never called the Nintendo Hotline. I was like, why would I do that when I could just literally go to the store and just pick up a magazine and look at it? Lee love AGBG and he got you into the 80s games. Yeah, man. Do you miss old AVG? Peko. I'm out of ammo. 
I must be uh, not picking something up. Must be a pickup that I'm uh, skipping that I wasn't because I was able to have enough ammo for the last time I ran out. Weird. Lara POV is what nightmares are made of. Really? Oh, with the inside the face. Why is Twitch crashing on you? What? How do I think Oppenheimer would felt if he realized he unleashed Natla? All you hundreds of you. Oh, cheesy Dorito. Thank you so much for the raid, man. Welcome, Raidors. Playing Tomb Raider. to be a penetrator. It's working out a little bit. The shotgun's definitely doing some penetrating. <clears throat> Madubu? Ah, oh, whatever, bro. Everybody complains about that level. <laughs> Go backwards, I'm telling you. Go backwards. Especially with a new camera, even in tank controls, you can look behind you. Cheesy as a skill issue. I do like that in like in, uh, in now even in tank controls, you have a free camera. That's also really cool. I mean, on top of photo mode. Unfortunately, I think the movable sound in the remaster is slightly different with HD graphics, actually. They're slightly different than the sound bites because they're the sound bites are based off the classic. You can if I actually run in classic graphics, they sound the same.
But they add like reverb filter. There's a few audio filters they put on uh, the sound effects. Oh dear, oh my, oh gosh. some shots off today that's all good we got cheese for Larson music is amazing and it cuts yeah I know that's the secret that's the power of the secret man <laughs> against him and I wasn't doing uh, all kills. I probably went out of ammo on him. They got bigger titties in there. <laughs> well, you have my total attention now. I'm not quite sure. There we go. How do I feel about the boss health bars? I've seen a lot of people complain, but I like it. I think they're fine. I mean, honestly, I think it's obviously more hardcore if you don't have the health bars, but it's whatever. I mean, if you don't want the health bars, then go to classic graphics. They don't, they're not there in classic. I mean, it would have been nice for them to have an option for it as well. But yeah, I think people are complaining about nothing because there is an option to turn it off. Go to classic graphics. Quit your complaining. <laughs> I played this game on PS1 with your brother and his friends. Such nostalgia. Oh, yeah, man. It's a good game. I find the health bar and meteorite cavern very useful. Yes. Especially on NG+, because I, I don't know how many shots it takes, actually, with the deagle in NG+. Salad Mage! What's going on, man? How have you been, sir? Oh. Secret. There's another secret. Kills the music. Thanks, secret. Thanks, Nathan McCree.
that would have been something that they could have remastered. I would have enjoyed if they would have um, done an audio duck on the music and play the secret sound. That would have been what they should have done, man. That would have been a good remastered thing to do. But no, don't hire an audio engineer. Actually, they probably, I mean, they had an audio engineer, it's clear. They they re, they added filters to the sound effects, so, in the master graphics, or HD graphics. <laughs> secret killing music. <laughs> Is that what I said? I meant music killing secret. Oh, I got the secret still, so still counts. Thank goodness. That was a mistake, though. So it doesn't happen when it matters. I should I should have two of three. Three or four, sorry. We're good. I missed out on some shotgun shells, so that's fine. You face forward, or you face the possibility of shock and damage. Well, bring on the shock and damage. Time to die. one okay st. Francis folly though guys yes we need to remember that this is where I died last time and the time before that and probably the time before that and I think also the time before that maybe not the time before that one but maybe the but definitely the time before that one <laughs> st. Francis folly has been the biggest cock block I've ever had it's blocking all of my cock, and that's pretty difficult to do. Yeah, well, you know, <laughs> it's just like uh, your opinion, man. Oh. It's too small, guys. <laughs> Dumb. <laughs> But it's a big deal. I don't think it's that big of a deal. <laughs> I made a mistake of doing NG plus with only pistols. I had to give up the pistols at the Temple of Puna. Oh yeah. I can I can only imagine how long that fight would take with the pistols only. Where's the bat? There's the bat. Just finished Egypt level. Awesome, DJ Ryan.
All right, you and me, Gorilla. Let's gape this ape. Oh. Ah, the ape is gaped. I hate any levels where they take your guns away. <laughs> yes. Uh, it's always a slap in the face. It's like, oh, you were relying on these, huh? Pretty heavily? Yeah, you can't use them right now. Oh, and by the way, here's some bad guys that are with a bat, a bat and a, a machine gun. Have fun. <laughs> All right, let's not forget Thor. I always I've always forget Thor for some reason. Alright, we'll just do it the safe way, but I know. You son of a what? Bro, St. Francis Folly, man. Oh my god. I should not be dying here. Let me do the safe method that I know. It'll be cool. Okay. Oh, wow. I don't know that I have time to uh, start another attempt. Unfortunately, I don't know if I can commit the time for an entire run. We have St. Francis Folly death compilation. That was weird. Well, I honestly need to practice this. I only turn off my death. So when I don't have my uh, death counter, attempt counter, then it's just practice, by the way. For those of you who uh, plan on swinging by. <sighs> That's just so... Okay, we need to figure this out, though. Where's uh, Where's this save at? Is this okay? Cool, perfect. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Now I know there's a way you literally could just run in here, and just it just works. I don't know how. I don't know how it works. I've I've seen people do it. I'm not sure how that how they do it though. See, I mean, I'm getting hit every time. I wonder what the what the secret is of that one. Yeah, I know. I'm just trying different strats since I'm practicing. I'm just trying out some different stuff. I understand the the normal way to do it. There really, you really can't step anywhere in the area. There is a period of time you can be in the area, right? So, I mean, that's the key really to this to this puzzle is there is a period of time where you can actually stand in there. I just don't know what it is or when it is. I mean, she's going to Yeah, it's going to go off basically anywhere in that area around the uh the metal tiles. See that? I mean, I was definitely in the, uh, it's safe in this section here, as we all know. Interesting. See, look at this. I mean, I'm able to... 
<laughs> Why can't it just work this well when I'm playing the freaking game? Look at this. This is crazy. So you don't even need the swan dive if you do it. Oh, there you go. Weird. Jermski, I hope you're having a good day. I guess I almost deleted Tomb Raider on one progress and started over. I ended up missing a key on level eight level. Hey, by the way, to anybody that's like new to Tomb Raider, like uh, multiple save slots, man. Multiple save slots. Don't always save over your previous save. Just save in multiple slots. Uh, you, that allows you to also kind of be like, oh, I should have been over there. I should have done this thing while I was over there. Oh, I've got a save over here. Let me just reload this save. It's super useful. Multiple slots, man. Don't be a noob raider. Yeah, that didn't work. I think it has something to do with the, when it's not actually going off, but I'm able to run on that tile that I just was on, too. I've got 10 med packs. We can use them. That's good. See, I can run on this tile just fine when coming into the room. And I can jump over those tiles just like that. See, this is what we're looking for. As I come in the room, I just run and just make sure I jump over the tile. And coming through here, what is it? I don't know. Look at this. Well, there, are, there is some issues with this, but I think we I need to narrow it, uh, iron run it out. <laughs> Multiple slots. Seems to shoot left to right. It, it's actually going to target you. If, you. if you're in the zone, it's always going to target you. It's just how the, the mechanic works. Um... There's just a there's like a window of opportunity though, and um, it looks like honestly, if we just run onto this third tile and jump over the other two tiles, we're fine. And then on the way back, that one tile that was deadly is no longer deadly. We just jump over it. I think that's really just. I mean. Yeah, if we can just come in. Oh. See, it didn't work on this side. I think... Huh, I wonder why. I wonder if it has anything to do with the distance to the globe as well. Because there is, even though this is a tile-based game, there is, like, half-tile distances for some for some ranges, too, by the way. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. The old view at times until patch. Yeah. So coming into the room, from coming back through is easy. You just jump before the metal tile. Just you gotta keep running. You just gotta keep running. And then coming through here, it seems if I'm all the way to the right, then I can do the same thing on the way out. But see, yeah, you also have vicinity to the vicinity to the, to the orb. So you want to be by the wall. This is it, man. This is the this is the ticket. This is the secret. There you go. You just gotta be quick. Just don't even think. Just run through, up against the wall. Just run and jump over the metal plate. Do it on the way back. Don't stop. If you stop, you die. And I'll show you that right here. Oh, maybe not. Oh, well, yeah. Okay, so it'll hit me there, but it won't hit me here. I love finding that kind of stuff out, man. That's plenty of room. That's plenty of room for a running jump. Cause it will not hit you on this tile. Maybe, maybe if you're on this side. This, yeah. Being up against that wall. That's the key, buddy. And then you can just run right through. Now I'm not sure. I know there's a strat. I've seen Foodie do it. He, he's a freaking mad, crazy guy in Tomb Raider. I saw him just run right through here like it was no joke. He's just like, yep, peace. Well, that. Whoa! Speedruns are crazy. Yeah, they are. Dude's insane. So, if, if you're going to go through the center, you're going to want to jump just at the very end of this bottom thing and dive. And then you can do a standing jump after the dive. See, this is... 
This is what I'm talking about, man. Learning strats, dude. I love this stuff. Figuring them out. I'm sure this has been, I'm not, I'm obviously not the first one to discover this crap, but. So one thing I've noticed is that if you're rolling on the ground, it doesn't seem like the electricity can even hit you or it won't even target you. Like you know, I'm even on the metal plate. So that's an interesting fact too about this room. That's how we're able to get through. Ah, that's how we're able to get, why we're able to go through the center because it won't target you if you're in the middle of a roll, it looks like. Swan dive from the stairs and swan again. I mean, you just do a standing jump out of it too. Oh, but that right there. I don't, okay, but I'd have the momentum coming from the save point. There we go. Cool. Um, we should do a back three run. We should do a back three attempt. Just start from Natla's Mines and do the last three levels. So yeah, as long as you don't land on this raised tile right here, you won't get shocked. But you gotta make sure that you jump at the right point there, otherwise you will. So the safe way would literally just to come over here and hug the wall and then jump over the, the metal plate. Jump just before the metal plate. I think we'll just stick to the safer method here. I think that's the no loads, no meds way. You come through here with just style points, really. <laughs> By the way, it is an achievement to have this block fall on your head. Okay, let's do a back three attempt, but I will take a break. I'm gonna take a break before we start uh, Natla's Mines, but we're gonna do a, we're gonna go from the back three and see if we can fi finish the game from there. All right. Since I don't really, I can't really commit to a full five hour run right now, but, and, but we still have some time for streaming, so I'll I'll stream that. Give me some time, bros. I shall return, bros. <laughs> Brother Chen Bakeng.
All right, who's ready for some stuff? Oh, I'm gonna just uh, put it in the stream so that way people are aware here. But it's. Uh... Look at that all. There. That way people know what, what's going on. Okay, so for this, we just start at Netless Mines. We just try to beat, beat the game from there. We're back three. I do also need to get some practice in on the Egypt levels at some point. And look at me, I'm forgetting already to put my sunglasses on. facing backwards and therefore I am facing the possibility of shocking damage what's a strap for torso guy jump around use shotgun don't fall off don't get hit but yeah basically balls of the wall strat I mean there's a dangle strat right I think uh you can dangle off the platform and then he'll get away and then you can get up and get some shots in. This is level 11? How many levels are there? 13? 11, 12, 13? I think there's 15. So this would be 12. No, this would be level 13. Right? How does that work? I mean, Torso Guy is easy compared to Skater Kid. Skater Kid is really the the wall in this run. Not Thor's room. <laughs> Can you believe it? Skater Kid and the darts. Um, yeah. And Great Pyramid. Natla also can definitely be a uh, a blocker of cocks, for sure. my least favorite oh what you're asking me to hate on something um well i gotta think now there's a lot of levels man damn what 
what tell yeah tell me your least favorite and maybe i'll i'll poke fun at you for being having a terrible opinion Yours is Temple Ruins. Yeah, I think that one's great. I love the Shiva guys. Those Shiva guys are so awesome. Um, what was the, what's the one after that? River Ganges. That one's hard. That one's difficult. That motor bike is kind of hard to control. Wadubu Gorge. There's a lot of hatred out there for that one. Yeah, I mean, it's not... And I, I see why. Honestly, the, the kayak isn't the best built. It's not the best. But whatever. I love literally everything about Maduba Gorge that doesn't include the kayak. <laughs> yeah. Maybe there's a no kayak run you could do on that one. I doubt it. No, because you got to go down the butt plug and you need the kayak to probably do that. Let's not forget this fuse today. Yes. Remembering things. Perfect. I wish there was an on foot run. Yeah. You know, I've been saying uh, backwards. It's, you know, if you need, if you have this camera now, I wonder if this actually works. It probably makes it harder, honestly. I have no idea. I haven't tried it, but for me, going backwards works pretty well. But I think that also it's because I know what's coming up. I try to explain that in my walkthroughs, so for new players, they're probably not wanting to go backwards. <laughs> like, wait, what? No. You did two Maria two pistols only and didn't get achievement. Unsure why. I wonder if like even pulling out a weapon negates it. Trying to get the trophy, making sure all the men survive and level the crash site, a massive pain. I think if you try not to get the secrets... Hang on. I think if you try not to get the secrets... Right, and then at the very end... When you have that onslaught of dinosaurs, you just run for the end. You gotta, you gotta launch a, a grenade, but... Chug med packs, launch a grenade, get out of there. You're, if your goal is to get the trophy, then you know, screw every other challenge, right? But you gotta also try to hit them with the uh, MP5. That MP5 is OP for Raptor spill.
just gotta make sure you're hitting them and not the <laughs> other dudes. Alright, I'm confident today is the day Cowboy's gonna shoot me. No, it's not, actually. It's not today, because you know why? I'm not in the middle of a run. If I was actually here in the middle of an official run... Okay. So, we under I think we understand Nothing personal. what's gonna happen here. face melted see this is why we might just want to kill him it's a risk to bypass him huge risk maybe uh, the TNT skip um, I but I don't pull the lever uh, that's a tough jump, though, you know? <laughs> when you get this double kill, the guy. Yeah. You gotta do it pistols only, though. <clears throat> Man, I forgot to put the fucking sunglasses on again. It's bad omens, bro. Bad. <laughs> Bros. Chat. I'm screwed. Crying like a little girl. Sorry. Do you still have the same YouTube channel or do you have a new one? Just wondering. I want uh, exclamation point uh, YT. And there will be a link to my YouTube channel. There it is. Oh man, it's debatable whether or not I should kill this guy, for real. <laughs> He'll take forever with just pistols, NG+. You're on mobile, so you can't click the link. Uh, it's at Badass Games Dash Official. That's all you need. Just go to YouTube, put that in the URL. Or you just could look up Badass Games Dash Official on YouTube. Wait. I grabbed the fuse, yeah?
Don't forget the fuse, man. <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. <clears throat> I got it, I got it. That's why I told you to save it. I saved it! You're sorry for asking questions? How dare you ask questions, man? What, what do you think this is? An encyclopedia? You think we're a freaking dictionary? What, man? Come on. No, no information for anybody. I'm vetoing all information. There we go. I passed the ball test. You're gonna die a lot on this level? Yeah. Have you not played this? Whoa! This game is pretty amazing, man. Matt got a ball test and he passed with flying colors. Level two on your phone. Oh, you're playing the phone. Is this an interesting way to go? Kinda. <laughs> Found a wall. <laughs> Found another wall. Oh, there they are. Right in your face, Laura. <laughs> Found another wall. <laughs> Let's hope this doesn't happen when it matters. I'm pretty sure you can... I guess you can't. Hold on a second, though. Ooh, yeah, see? All right, let's do this. We can use that trick for style points later. <laughs> Using a controller, yeah. <clears throat> controller or keyboard, yeah. Keyboard's pretty cool from... What I've heard, I don't use a keyboard because I've been so used to controller forever. But I can see how it's... You can touch... You can press more buttons. Obviously. So... There's a lot of benefits to using the keyboard.
All right, let's hope this guy. Ain't nothing personal. Well, I hope not, man. I hope not. Oh, yeah, this is just too risky. I don't know if we can... We should try this. It just happens every once in a while that he'll shoot at you. Sometimes he does it, sometimes he does not. See, I mean, I got lucky here. Hey, Jokers, what's going on? <laughs> See, but the thing is... I think that's kind of risky. I'd hate to get this far into a no no meds and die because he decides to kill me. <laughs> I cannot trust in our in Jesus. RNG to the safe sometimes. It's true. It is true. So if I decide to do the TNT skip, I would have I wouldn't be able to come back. I'd be well I would. I'd be able to shoot the cowboy from a range and pretty much just snipe him. And then I could uh make sure I get down to get the secret. Cuz the TNT skip skips the secret. So if you're doing all secrets you can't do that. Freaking. Unless there's a jump back that I don't, that I can't figure out. There is always that possibility. Somebody knows something. <laughs> this jump here, maybe, maybe you could just run and jump no I think I'm just gonna hit the slope if I do that you might be able to run and jump from here like hit this corner just right but you still have the ceiling to worry about so yeah I don't know these remasters look good. They look freaking amazing. What's up, Bay Me? How you doing? Which Dark Souls game is my favorite? I like uh, Dark Souls One uh, so far. Uh, Dark Souls Three. Um, I really want to get more play time on that one. But I also don't discount Dark Souls Two. Dark Souls Two is also awesome.
Tomb Raider 1 feels so... I keep saying this, but Tomb Raider 1 feels so much better with the Tomb Raider 2 controls baked into it, man. Okay, so... No. She says no. That's fine. We got pistols anyway. So that's too far. This w what I'd like to find is the the uh, range where he hits you, but he where he fires you, but he doesn't hit you, and be do be able to do it from here. myself up here oh looks like I'm like right on the next tile ahead just barely but he's still not coming looks like it's about here Once we get here, it, it's all about just getting to the secret, right? So I just want him, I guess I just want him dead for now. I guess we can honestly totally skip him. I really don't even care if I pick up his magnums or not. Dead? <laughs> Got him! <laughs> Hell, Smith, that's a good one. Uh, yeah, looks like I guess he's dead, bro. So I would, I need to practice this jump up here because this jump up here is a heart attack. Although if you miss, it's fine. You still can do the other strat. It's it's pretty interesting how that's put together. I can make this jump back, y'all. Yeah. Y'all, there's a save crystal over here. Wait, hold on a second though. Yeah. I mean, you could go the long way to get around. Honestly, you could just fall from here. Yeah, you can just fall from here still. That'll get you to the secret. That way you can guarantee that he's not going to hit you and you can, all you do is just take fall damage. But then again, you're spending a lot of time as well dealing with him, which the longer you take, the more burnout you get. So the idea is to also try to avoid length of time you're spending. Right. So. So this would be the way, uh, a way. Um to get back to the secret after doing the TNT skip. Can you run into, you cannot sprint. I don't need to get the secret, I already got it.
Yeah, let's save here real quick. <clears throat> Put this one all the way up here. Uh, so I think this is a... Uh... Oh, I could just load that one. That's Skater Boy. Good. But this one's with uh, Cowboy <sighs> Dead. But from what I understand, I think even the TNT skip might have issues with uh, the cowboy hitting you. I've heard about that as well, so... But let's see if we can figure out this uh, TNT skip. We can get that, if I can figure out how to get that consistent. If I fail, I still can do this. So it's not a big deal if I fail. And then I can just uh, hope to avoid them. So I mean, that's a pretty nice little uh, skip to try to do. Hey, Rich, what's going on? Yeah. I wish I had a save crystal closer. Maybe I have a just a regular um, NG game that I can practice this on. Because I want to see how often he actually hits you. But he's dead in this one. Oh, if I if I do that, I oh see even even if I miss it from like that, I still um let's load let's load up um a regular I don't I think I have one oh well um that's fine. Let's try uh we're gonna try it from the back three again here and we'll go we're gonna go all the way through oh, Okay, we're gonna put on the sunglasses sunglasses are required, right? There we go I'm sure they're on now Get up on it. <laughs> I think it's the sunglasses, man. I think maybe that's why uh, I've been failing in here. I don't think the sunglasses have anything to do with Thor, man. <laughs> For all you superstitious out there. Oops. Son of a biatch. Sprint in tier one and tier two might be overkill. We don't really need them. <clears throat> right? The puzzles are designed for with being without them. Well, there's puzzles in tier three with it that are designed with them. Alert if no sunglasses. Hey, you do whatever you want if there's no sunglasses, man.
Well, I hope everybody had a wonderful weekend, by the way. It is the end of the weekend, and you, you know, hopefully had a relaxing one. I look tired as AF. It's all good. It's Yeah, it's all good. I am not that tired, but I'm good. I'm all right. Your weekend was good? Awesome, awesome, awesome. <clears throat> Are you doing some uh, ribbon there, Dom? Cool, bro, cool, bro. That's okay. I'm in the zone, if anything, man. I'm in the zone. It's straight up. Oh. Can you not get down with the straight up? Or are you about all about the straight down? Oh, straight up. Slight curve now. Christ, man, there's just some things you don't talk about in public. Hook shaped, you mean? It's a glorious hole, isn't it? Alright, pass the ball test. We've got the fuse. You know what I'm going to do with the fuse? I'm going to stick it in a hole. The fuse, this is auto zone. Oh yeah. It's a glorious hole, isn't it? I mean, I honestly could just skip the pistols. That'd be a pretty hardcore thing to do, too. But I do need to kill Cowboy, so yeah. You know, oh, there's a hook here. We can't... That hook's gonna jack with it. Yo. Hey, Zen, what's going on?
Haven't seen you in a while, man. I think I've seen you on X. All right, wish me luck. Ain't nothing personal. Oh well. Ouch. He did do some melting there. It's shoddy time. Let's hope I nail the uh, skater boy skip too. Although I should probably fight him as well. I hate doing that. <laughs> Hadn't caught the uh, previous Nolas do Meds at streams. Oh man. I think you're in some of the videos. We got the tint. You're now at the second game at the monastery, and I keep repeating the sound from the chat. Brother Chen back <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yeah. Brother Chen Baking. What's going on? Oh my gosh. Um, should be salvageable here. Nope. How the frick? If I would have jumped and turned around. Now in TR1 controls, I would have been screwed. But with these controls, I, I did have a way out of that. I did have a way out of that. Oh, that's fine. It's fine, man. That's why we practice. <laughs> Jump spin in the air, yeah. 
Damn, dude. <clears throat> I died like that in a tier two attempt as well because I didn't realize about I didn't think about the jump spin. Yeah, those were sad times. Okay, let's do it again. We go again. We got time. We got time. Oh, I forgot this freaking sunglasses though. We had a saying, if you found a band, if you founding a band and short on the drummer, get a pair of Uzis instead. Get an M16. Did I fail at St. Francis Folly again today? Nah, it wasn't St. Francis Folly at all. Not a single death. <laughs> Did I make progress? Oh, it was amazing. We made it all the way to St. Francis Folly. <laughs> can't be dying bro we can't be dying there's no this should be zero deaths that's how, how it should be How are you guys doing today? So I heard you guys had all, all had a great weekend. Anybody just starting to do it? Dude, the weather's starting to warm up around here. We can finally steal back the weather from Brazil. It's our it's our weather, man. Our weather. Get your own weather. Make sure it's cold. Good night, Maro Rasadi. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate you stopping by, man. Got him. Come on, Laura, we got this.
I need to see Willy Wonka experience. What the heck? Why must I see something like this? I don't understand. A Wonka themed meth house. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want to go there. That sounds horrendous. It sounds terrifying, honestly. Chuck goes there all the time. Oh. Patronage, huh? What is it like? What is it like a place you go to a movie? Is it like a dessert? What the hell? Is it a candy bar? Is it a chocolate candy bar with a gold ticket inside of it? It's an absolutely disastrous exhibitionist column that was absolutely a scam. It's worth looking at. Y'all crazy. That's cool. Hang on a second, and I will do a reading. I will do a reading on the ch of the chat. Sum it up, people paid 35 pounds for the Willy Wonka experience, but what it was is a warehouse full of random props that have nothing to do with it. It looked terrible. And you guys would recommend I should go to this place? What the hell? I should fly all the way to Scotland? Pay 35 pounds for a meth themed, um, meth themed Willy Wonka experience, whatever, and with, with no props. I mean, that description alone is definitely makes me feel like I'm on LSD for sure. Ain't nothing personal. Oh my god, that is a risk. That's kind of a huge risk. Oh, but if I, okay. If I blow it up, that's fine. That's almost just as risky as, uh... Oh, but no, I don't want to jump. Oh. Fuck. I don't want to jump, I just want to grab and drop. Oh, freaking sunglasses. 
I, I hope I'm giving hope to all of the people out there who, who believe in me for this run. Or taking it away, one of the two. I hope I'm doing one of the two. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Failure, my friend. It's the only way to learn. Public humiliation is also a good way to learn. <laughs> Every death is a new discovery. Correct, exactly. Exactly, I realized what I did wrong. You know what, honestly, I learned I learned something there too. There's actually a nice little skip there that you can kind of skip the drop grab, but I don't think it's worth try, uh, trying. I think the risk isn't there. Cause I honestly, she went straight forward for a split second, like a frame, dude. And then she went toward the lava. And that was like, oh, you know what? You could probably just backflip and then backflip and do whatever, but I'm, I don't know. I don't know if... I just want to drop grab you. That's just what I want. So that's what I'm going to do. YouTube's been rather quiet. Did the YouTubers F off or what? I need to get, I need to get uh, YouTube in stream because there's been a lot of chatter on uh, YouTube today that could have been in the uh, in the stream. Do I know the weapon sheet? Uh, yeah. You do some you do some dance moves and bam you got some weapons. Yeah, I'm familiar. I'm familiar with it. You stop believing me since I can't beat St. Francis Folly. Get real, bro. It's a fluke, man. It's a fluke, man. I'll prove you wrong one day. You will eat those words, Coplex. I stopped believing in anyone once uh, found Santa isn't real. Oh, ha! Santa's real, man. He's based off of Saint Nicholas, who is actually a, uh, a gift giver. Ain't no road brand jumping into my property. Hey, dude, he's, I mean, I'm just saying he's just, he's just a real guy. St. Nicholas is a real guy. Uh, he's not alive anymore. And he, I don't think he wore a red suit. Well, he may have wore red because he was a saint and he probably had a lot of money. He's buying gifts for kids and stuff. Um, yeah, real guy. Is this near the end of the game? Yeah, but we're I'm not in a full run right now. I'm in uh I'm doing a back three practice. I'm actually in the first level of the back three, so the last three levels. But uh Yeah. I've gotta fail to everything at least once. It's just how it is. I wonder how close I am to that uh, achieving that death of dying in every way. I haven't even tried to get any of the deaths, so... They've just been happening. So Santa's dead. <laughs> I mean... 
You said it, not me, bro. <laughs> oh, crap. Pull out flare, hold, walk, walk forward, jump backwards around three times, then back, back flip, jump backwards. I think that's the explode code. Stop crying like a little girl. I'm sorry, man. But I don't know the I don't really know the codes by heart. I never use them. You're about to do finish arcs tech mines. What? Pain level it is. That's also a uh, showstopper. No lows, no meds. Because that freezing water s swim. Oh, and the bell, the diving bell. I don't know if you've been that to that point yet, but. It's a pain. It's a pain. You're about to finish up your Kleenex. You might want to go out and get some more. Here we go. It's easy to get all the all deaths, one death from every enemy trap and a couple force like diving to death. Yeah, I know I've already done that one all right. <laughs> all right. I love making Lara crunch. I just love making her neck go snap it's just satisfying does that make does that make me a terrible person press one in chat if you think I'm a terrible person go 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 spam no. it spam it spam it spam it no N no 69 Nine. You're a bad man. Um, there we go. That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get this jump. Ain't nothing personal. Stay oh, away ain't. from the summoner. Oh nope. It's okay. We still get shot at. I think that jump is actually more dangerous than this. I mean, obviously, the less danger I want to say less dangerous is to kill him, but on a lots just straight up fight him, but that's still dangerous. I don't know if there's really a completely safe strat. This is probably the safest. I think this is the safest. If you're able to get up there and pull that lever, then that will save you some time, but that's about all you gain because you, you then you just don't have to move the TNT block. That's just all you look you gain, really. We're doing all secrets, then uh, you do need to get make sure you go this way. For real. <laughs> I didn't get a lot of answers on that one. 
I'm just gonna assume that people think I'm a terrible person because no, not too many people answered. Um, the reason why I think it's a good idea because uh, a lot of people are afraid to to voice their negative opinion, which when well, I'm not afraid or just they just think that it's just not necessary. It's like, oh well, I don't really like this guy, but uh, I don't think it's necessary that I call him out. That's what I think. Thanks for your feeble attempts <laughs> at trying to protect my uh, my feelings. Yeah, well, you know, that's just like uh, your opinion, man. There we go. But for real, for real. What's for real, for real? They got bigger titties in there. All right, some con someone console me. Don't, don't touch me. Making our crunch. Oh, I agree. I think we all should. She deserves it sometimes. Sometimes she's just like, you tell her to do something and then she doesn't do it. And even though it's your fault, you still nice. You could just take it out on her because she's not going to complain. She's still going to play. She's still going to play Tomb Raider with you. No matter how many times you break Lara's neck, she's just like, all right, let's go Tomb Raiding. Yay! <laughs> we got past the dumb stuff. <clears throat> Found a wall, too. There it is. In all of its glory. Where's Cowboy, dude? Alright, let's hope Skater Kid, I can just skip him. I really don't want to fight him. I really just don't want to fight him. I really want to be consistent with the skip. Success? Success? Yay. Yay! I don't know that I really need to pick up all the Susie ammo because I got a ton. Although I still have okay, I have 34 ammo. That's 30. That's 3,400. Um, that's a lot. So yeah, I don't really need all the uh, ammo. But then again, I am going to be not grabbing it. This is a this is a all pit all items save so I have like all the items well for the most part all the items on this save this is when I did my original NG plus playthrough
All right, let's continue on. Wait, how did I miss it? No way. Oh. Weird. I don't think I've ever found that before. That's strange to me. He's about to finish. Okay, so comment and Cam said he's about to finish Arx Tech Mines. Calls it a pain level, bro. Our uh, Le Lost City of Tenos is next. Just want to point that out. <laughs> when we talk about a pain level, Lost City of Tenos, I think is that's a pain as well. But all right, honestly, Arx is, yeah, is also a pain. Those minecarts are kind of a, a pain to deal with. Especially for the first time. Lost City of Tinos is the bane of your existence. Okay. I mean, this level's down. Flaw City ain't that bad if you know a few bugs and glitches, but yeah, it's still a ball. A ball. <laughs> you freaking. Oh, I think it's too late as well. Dang it. I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it. Oh, don't, don't got it. Don't got it. Oh, that was gonna be it too. Crap. That was good timing. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The water puzzle in Tenos is the worst. Yeah, that's a uh, that's a pain. I mean, no loads, no meds. That's a sphincter ripper for real. Ripper. <laughs> oh, well. 
Whoa, let's not do any glitching here. It's a banana! It's a banana croft. A banana croft. How you doing? How's NG treating me? Oh, well, we got through Natla's Mines. We're about to go into Atlantis. So we're doing a back three practice. So basically, this is the back three levels. See what we can do. I mean, these are going to be the hardest levels. So we got to get some practice in on it. And being able to do them all without dying in itself is actually pretty, uh, in my opinion, it's pretty good. So I forgot the glasses. That's all right. It's all right. I honestly like this level a lot now. Oh crap, I didn't want to do that. That's all right. It's just annoying. I like this level a lot now. <laughs> it's time for a T-Raid! Join the freaking T-Raid. If you don't T-Raid, I will ban you. <laughs> What's up, Sarah Queen? Back for more, huh? Great Pyramid is ass in NG+. Yeah, those darts. Those embers. Oh, I don't need to. I've already spawned that dude. Oh, they both gotta be right here, huh? That's fine. Where am I on health? Full health. Perfect. Full health is good. I mean, literally can't do better than that. Those drones are making your dog bark. <laughs> Man, honestly, I'm just gonna cue the secret and go. I got plenty of stuff, so I think, uh, in the sake for the sake of time, just cue and go. No. 
No. Not it, huh? There it is. Those groans made your mom stop watching so much for family friendly. Well, I mean, if she can't handle Atlantean groans and she's just not a real Tomb Raider bro there. That's all I gotta put it. That's just all I gotta say about that, bro. You have to love grunt noises. I don't know why, but in order to like Tomb Raider, it's just required. Let's only pull the levers that I need to pull in this other room. I forget how far I am from that room, but this level will be interesting blindfolded for sure. I think if I pull these back to last, we can skip the Atlantean. There's some ammo here if I need it to. Cheating? I'm not cheating, man. <sighs> hey, John Michael, sober. What's up? He's already here. That's crazy. Why is he flying off? Is he outside? This guy is going to tax me at a later date. I feel it. Dude, I, he went through the ceiling. He's gone. He's gone. What the frick, man? I mean, come on, man. How you want me to do with that? He's gonna tax me. He's gonna come down like that one guy did. Shotgun guy that one time. And my two meter. Get your anus out. Are you gonna go up through it there with him too? You too? Oh, I didn't think so. Don't blow up my yeah, go there and blow your load. Oh yeah, it's beautiful.
Are you effing me? Come on, bros. You gotta be asking my D right now. Uninvited. No invite, uninvited essing of the D. None. Now this guy is gonna be a tax. Look at him. Oh yeah, come on. Yeah, buddy. Now we got you. Now we're playing. Yeah, pistols only. <laughs> Are you assing my D again? Tank controls for the win, just saying. Just saying. Finish him. There we go. Those Uzis make a great sound. I think so too. I think they sound great. I think they're from uh, Unfinished Business. Let's hope these guys behave. Come on, bros. Don't don't ask my D. What did I say?
Very cool. Down cam really messes with my cons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, here's uh, here's the deal. If you think that this is that this is a cheat, if you if you don't think that this is a cheat, right? then you also have to agree that this is not a cheat. Just saying. I think that that's... I think that's, uh... Up to Coastal Village. And not cheating, it's in the game. <laughs> I think they may have done that intentionally. What is this sorcery? <laughs> <laughs> oh man oh we might be able to skip the uh maybe we can skip the door closed tile i don't really think i need to maybe for all kills it'd be nice but let's check it out since i'm here i think it's two wi tiles wide though so we're gonna do a skip here two tiles then Whatever. I tried. Oh, I just got two people twice. That doesn't go well. Ooh, I almost got me balled again. It's best if you get you jump twice like this. Balls might be a problem though. He's uh he's been known to be iffy. I almost received the pelvis. The music is dope AF. Yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it?
Whoop. All right, that's Natla's mines and Atlanta's down on the back three, so. You can't do this. We condemn you, Natla of Atlantis, for your crimes. All right, sunglasses. Let's do this. Torso guy. I do not like where he went. Oh god. The jump turn around is is OP as hell for this fight. Joseph is down. Torso, torso guy. Yay. All right, I really don't need to pick up much ammo, I don't think. You can just move on. How many times it, how, so there's that slope I died on with the axe you guys remember that how often does anybody here die to that axe or have you died to that axe in your playthrough like what's the deal man I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about because I don't know if anybody was here for that but Isn't that slope timeable? How dare you! <clears throat> I mean, normally I just go, you know? I never have an issue with the axe. The axe never cuts me. Which is why I'm asking the question, because it's like it just randomly hit me this time. I mean, it seemed like it was legit. It didn't look, it looked like there was definitely a hitbox that got hit. So it looked pretty damn legit, but I just never, I just don't recall ever getting hit by it.
It's sub-older time. Which acts no, it's in here. It's actually coming up. Pretty soon. See, you don't people don't even know what I'm talking about because nobody dies to it. It's after the darts, I'll show you guys, whatever. It's no bueno, my friend. Oh, I got hit by all three darts this time. Can you believe it? Naturally, because I'm in the middle of a run that's uh, doing pretty well. I mean, why wouldn't it? Naturally. <laughs> Oh god. Oh no! I don't think I've died that way yet. After getting the second secret, there is a setup to be able to jump over the boulder. Are you aware of it? Let me think. Oh, I don't... I'm not gonna... I, if that's just, just to save some time, I'm not too concerned about it. That sounds very uh, dangerous, but... Um, I'm sure it's consistent if you have the right moves, but... I'm just tr I'll just trigger and run. It doesn't matter, man. Alright, let's, um, let's load up Great Pyramid again. Wait, where's that other save at? Oh, this is for the darts. Yeah. This is for dart practice. Damn, son. Okay. I can't do it at all now. Gotta love it. I just can see uh, better with the 30 FPS, man. So that's why I do it. All right, I'm confused on that one, dude, because that's my. This is literally what I was been doing. So that too. Oh. Yeah, get burnt. Damn, that's 
close. There we go. Why, why, why? Oh, I'm hitting hit. I got hit twice. Even though my... Oh, my... Freaking darts, man. They trip me up. There we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I don't know if I can find uh, I don't know. I'm using visual cues in the uh, classic style. I wonder if there's a... Uh... Let's see how I can do with uh, these graphics. Let's finish this level off. Whatever. Let's just get a let's just get a fin finale going here. Good practice session though. Learn some stuff. That Thor room should be pretty easy now. I actually should go back to that real quick and uh, just uh, refresh myself on what I've learned there. So that way it helps really ingrain that that stuff in your head. You know. Fair enough, man. As far as I'm aware, the setup is consistent because you shimmy to the end of the crack in the wall. It just lets you deal with boulder first so you can take your time with the axe. Oh, I see. I never really had an issue with the axe. It's strange. It's a very strange occurrence. The axe, like, 99.9% .9 of the time has missed me. That means one in a thousand. <laughs> uh. I feel like it's been literally that. Oh yeah, there we go. I should probably take a sidestep so I can just avoid the thing. I'm getting dead. I'm getting dead. Son of a bitch. All right, darts again anyway. Let's just see the darts. That's why I told you to save it. If you didn't save it, shame on you. Oh, I just got hit twice. That's so lame. I, I would hate it if that happened in a run. I would just freaking destroy two meter one man. Just throw it out the window. Yeah, yeah, that feels right. Okay, I see what I think I was doing wrong earlier. Minor details, man. Minor is just super tiny. Whoa. Super minor positioning thing is all it is, man. It's all it takes. Oh, for that axe? That axe that's not the axe that I died to. I'll show you. This isn't the one that I died to. There's another axe just after this one, actually. This axe I'm not too concerned with. I mean, I, I just gotta time it right. It's all that one is. Yeah, it's just a timing thing for that one. But this other one, it's just like a random... See, nobody knows what axe I'm talking about because they don't die to it.
Yeah, there's a slope, exactly. All right, I think the best plan of action is literally to take a step back and then sidestep so you avoid the crystal. And that puts you further back so you don't get hit by embers. I'm to I, okay, I know what my Q is and I definitely am not using it. I know what my Q is. That's fine, it's giving me more practice on these uh, darts too, which is perfect. Getting hit twice by that freaking dart, that's annoying. To get hit by that one's annoying too. I got hit by all three. Come on, man. Come on. That would be a death, most likely, in a Nolos Omits. by the last secret no not that axe either see nobody <laughs> nobody knows this axe nobody except for me because I've died to it today I believe and everybody's seen it everybody knows it exists but nobody dies to it so nobody knows what I'm talking about when you guys see it you're like oh yeah hundreds of you and oh, Xena Raider, thank you so much for the raid. Living up to the name. <laughs> What's going on? Raiders. Doing some raiding ourselves. Okay, I'm listening to the whoosh. Yeah, there we go. And then I... No. I gotta go win the whoosh. I can't believe I'm failing on this one, too. I can't believe I'm failing this axe. It's a good thing I'm here. This axe, I didn't even have an issue with it. Not until now. So that's good. I'm glad that I'm failing now and not later during an actual run, so. How about you face my ass? Damn it. What the hell? <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Hopefully we can get to this freaking axe, man. I just want to show everybody this freaking axe. That's all I want to do, so I can sleep ne nicely tonight, and you guys can know what axe I'm talking about. That's all I want, man. Hey, Angry Carrot, what's going on? What is the furthest attempt so far? City of Kamun. Whoop, zoop, sloop. I don't know. What, okay, I just need to practice leaving. I don't need to pick all this stuff up. Yeah, so we pick that up and then a step. Oh, not like that. Sometimes it's all about going wide. It's this, it's this, it's this axe right here. Everybody pay attention. It's this axe right here. The axe that literally just killed me again. Ah. 
the axe nobody ever dies to. Is it harder time? No, it's super easy. It's like I'd never even think about it. But now lately it's been killing me. It's crazy. And I don't think it's a remaster thing either. issues, I guess. Oh, I'm dead. I knew it. That's a run under axe? Yeah, it's usually not even questionable whether or not it's a run under. It's usually just like, oh, look, an axe. There it is. And all of a sudden, it's just killing me every time. It's freaking me out, man. It's like I'm living in a different universe. I don't think it's a remaster issue. I think it's really just a luck issue. Look, I'm getting hit by that dart, too. There we go. What I want. Son of a mother... Let's go ahead and get in practice on these darts. Alright, screw the uh, secret up here, actually. I'm not too concerned about the secret, obviously. I just want to get through these parts that are kicking my ass. Oh my god, dude. Let's do all the deaths now, you know? Let's do all of them now. Because I need practice on these darts anyway. another axe that people probably wouldn't know about is that axe right there because that axe um nobody dies to that one either but i'm just gonna skip the secret i don't really care about secrets here i'll just die here oh my god this is painful this is freaking painful guys This is honestly what it's like playing Dark Souls when I'm not streaming. For whatever reason, when I'm streaming, I just do really well. It's just a, just a timing issue right there with the darts. I mean, you got to be pretty precise, it seems. Uh, the, the margin for error there is very low. All right, skipping the secret, damn it. You can't stop me, chat. Okay, usually I set up here and then I wait for the whoosh. It's like that. And then I get to slide right on in. That's what I normally do for that one. Okay, so this is the guy? I normally just ignore him. Yeah. He almost killed me there, but... I don't know, man. Like, I've never ever even thought of that axe. As a potential threat. I 
I know get secret? What? Wait. Oh yeah, because I just wanted to practice the uh, the jumps or the uh, going by the act. Just kind of go through here, really. It just takes too long with that whole shimmy thing. I just didn't really care. I just don't really. I don't need to practice the shimmy, so it's not a problem if I skip it. That's why. All right, for this one, I I literally go to the ledge, hop back twice, and wait for a whoosh. Whoosh. It works for me. And then just do a regular run and jump. Don't try to time yourself at the ledge. Regular ass run and jump. Regular ass run and jump. Oh, it's too far, isn't it? We gotta learn the style points on that one. <laughs> And skipping of the second secret because we don't need to practice shimmying is trivial. Just, just two two darts of damage should be okay. I think that should be fine, but Natla is a uh, very iffy fight though too. At least Nine phase one, die. phase two, she's kind of easy. the natlas skip what's the natlas skip what is the whoosh sound i'm referring to when the axe is swinging it makes a whoosh sound damn it this was one of the reasons why I was like the fact that they put uh, two year two controls into two meter one because this uh, jump sequence wasn't possible to, to do efficiently with two meter one controls. There. On the tiny slope below the platform, you can jump one step before the wall and on an angle and it teleports you then. Oh yeah, I don't. If it teleports you, that's too. Uh, that's glitchy to me. Uh, it, it, your character shouldn't be teleporting, in my opinion, if it's. Uh, Intended. I mean, I, yeah, we got the trophies and stuff, but like for for no glitch runs, we shouldn't be teleporting anywhere. But yeah, that sounds interesting. I may want to know it for. Um. I may want to know about it for you know glitch stuff because I I don't know enough glitches so. Okay, listen. You hear the whoosh? Yeah, so you just right when you hear right when the whoosh goes. Or, yeah, right after. One of the two. Okay, we don't need to pick any of this stuff up. So for, I'm gonna do a run and jump for that hole. Okay, it's two tiles. Got it. That's the style. That's the style right there, buddy. I'm gonna die to that during uh, no lows, no meds now. So if I'm gonna show, if I'm gonna be showing off, I gotta die. Yeah, it's just how my life goes. I gotta die in that way a few times before 
it actually lets me have that style point. All right, I think I should use. Let's use a. Uh, let's actually use that. I want to go back over here. I think. Fall damage alone. Forget the darts. Some bitch, man. I can't even kill myself. Natla is definitely going to be also a cock block, it seems. Okay, so I have to consider, even with my life given here now, that when I fall, there's a fall damage here. There is a skip for the fall damage. It's a, it is a glitch, though, so for uh, Nolozo Meds, you have to take the damage. Because Nolozo Meds is glitchless. Damn it. So with the fall, I'd probably have like half a life, but I use a save crystal to save at this point, so I healed. I took a little bit of spike damage there. So I wouldn't have very much life at this point. To be fair. This axe never kills me until today. But now it's, see, it's just doing whatever. It's a whatever axe right now. Get out of here, axe. Oh, yeah, okay. I deserve that one. Now I'm just being cocky? Shut up. <laughs> oh man, okay. Damn it. Son of a monkey, but this is why we practice, bros. This is going to be a very tough level on NG+. Man thing. 
but doable but doable Okay. All you hundreds of you talking and Oh, Wellstone, thank you for the raid, up. man. Well, what's up, dude? Doing some practice on the back three levels here for Nolo's Nomads. Uh, almost done, actually, so. Hopefully Natla doesn't meatball me in the face. I don't like meatballs in my face. Well, actually I do. Um, but only when there's spaghetti involved and red sauce. Otherwise I could pass. benefit to um going in the in the cave i don't know man hey what's up lala what's going on Wait, what the hell? Oh my gosh, the embers, bro. Oh my god, damn. The luck here is just horrendously bad. The luck is just horrendous. My God, I got hit by the dart. Oh, dude. Okay, whatever. Son of a bitch, man. No sunglasses. Oh, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I keep forgetting to put them on for during these practice, this practice stuff. And it makes me sad because I know that one day I'm gonna get to these levels and I'm just gonna forget and then be like, God damn it, I gotta start over. But fortunately, it's just practice. I need to practice putting your sunglasses on. I agree.
Oh, dude, the embers, bro. Okay, man. Okay, man. Dart in the back. Ugh. Okay, that one we do. We gotta eat. We gotta eat that one. Okay, fine. This one, we don't have to eat it. Yeah, this one, we don't have to eat any of them either. Ah. Alright, whatever. So hard, dude. So hard. I guess I could just immediately jump. That might be the way to do it. Well, of course, I'm gonna come up from the secret. Yeah, still can maybe immediately jump. I don't know, we'll have to think about that one. I'm really not here to practice that, so. Oh my God, that never acts. Is like getting so close every time now. The never axe is becoming an always axe. An occasional axe, yeah. A once in an occasion, an axe. Just for me. Miss Natla, I need you to keep your meatballs to yourself. I'm not interested in them being in my face. Miss Natla, Miss Natla, Miss Natla. Miss Natla. Why are you? Why is she all about the wall today? What happens if I go in here? Maybe I should try to take her over to the other side of the uh, pyramid. But I don't like her getting close, man. She's, uh... Oh, she hit me with a tri-blast. Alright, one last try, and then I gotta go, guys. Double dart. I hope that doesn't happen on a goddamn run, dude. There you go, Laura. Nice. Yes. to me. 
go just go forget the embers man just go Because I jumped. I jumped so her animation. I could have rolled probably to avoid it, but frick. All right, last one. Don't hit me again. Ah, nice, nice, nice. legs baby I need to practice the style points on that too oh no oh no just go oh god oh no It's like timed so well. Maybe if I go center. Wait, what? Are you freaking? I I have to die in every possible way, don't I? Literally. I'm not even trying to get this achievement, and it's gonna get. Okay, one more time. One more try. Double hit by the arrow. Nice. Cool. Yay. You see what happens, Larry? You see what happens, Larry? <sighs> I need to find an audio cue because I think they're more reliable. that way too. All right, one more time. You need to die in every possible way first. Get it out of the system. You freaking dart. Oh my god, I hate that freaking dart. I hate that dart, man. Freaking dart. And last run, I swear, I swear, guys, we're gonna be done here after this. Promise. Hit the wall. Side jump. Or die. Oh! <laughs> Where'd that luck come from? Again. All right, one more time. An excellent death. <laughs> yeah. These deaths are pretty bad. I need to figure out how I can just like time my way so I only get hit by that thing once. Because getting hit twice is not good. That's very bad. Hit by that one sucks too, to be honest. 
at all, period. Whoop. I get hit by all of them. I gotta figure something out with those darts, man. I guess I could use classic graphics. Jump there, man. All right, one more time. showstopper for real and run into penetrators whoa why did i jump there oh my god we gotta die in every way bro i'm telling you all right one more try this is going to be the last one ever the last one ever everyone the last one ever hope you've enjoyed the content today of me dying over and over again but you know this part's necessary you know? it's part of the learning process I still wish it would not hit. The windows are very tight on those, uh, very, very tight on those darts. <sighs> I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, I got hit by a freaking ember. Can't catch a break, guys. Can't catch a break. Oh, I'm overshot. I'm overshot it. Yeah. All right, this is the last one. One more. a baby in the throat oh no oh god I'm dead not dead oh not dead oh I'm dead I'm dead oh not dead not dead <laughs> That was close, though. Right, I'm dead here for sure. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, the never axe was an almost axe. Now let's not get tripped up by the lava. That's awesome. What the fuck? There is no way, man. All right, one more time. One more time. All right, I'll see There's no what the hell happened there. That's a hitbox issue there. Yeah, I think so, man. Yeah, let's go right by that guy. You're entering a world of pain. 
Yeah, swing those legs, baby. Yeah, center, I think, is the... Now, what the hell is up with this? Don't you dare! Freaking hitbox, bro. I've literally died in almost every way. I haven't gotten hit by these boulders yet, so that's po that's another thing I can die to. I did... Oh, I think... There's a new one. That's a new one, too, I think. Missing that jump like that? That's new. Alright, one more try. Okay, it's not that it's pretty easy to time it if it's, I've been just kind of going and that's probably what my issue is there for that one Yes, yes Damn it son of a arrow what a piece of bacon the hell It's like a flesh dart isn't it a f the flesh dart penetrated me Center. Center seems safest. There. Okay. Alright, let's not die to these boulders. Let's make the jump. Okay. If you stick your landing there, you die too. <laughs> so that's uh, pretty amazing. So yeah, I think I want to go over here, grab these, then these, then go around and grab these. Then it's a nice little dive down into the water, the water, the water, the water. There is a strat like this, I think, where she just dumps the, uh, dumps it into the ceiling, yeah. Some 
bro. Actually, I gotta die that way too. Alright, one more time. One more. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. One more. That is it. 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 Oh my god. That was crazy close. Oh. oh, I naturally deserved. I deserve both those darts. All right, retry. I need to figure this out, dude. Like these darts, I can't be. I can't be losing to these darts, man. I don't want to get all the way here and die to the darts. I don't want to get all the way here and die to now the dumb stuff. Not less difficult. Okay, I got hit by one. I got hit by one dart. Okay, fine, fine. I'll. I think getting hit by one dart that you're trying to avoid is fine. It should be okay as long as the Natla fight goes well. But lately, meatballs have been uh, penetrating the face, so we need to make sure that we avoid that meatball penetration. No. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! No axe is a no axe. Okay. I think as long as I stay to the left of that lava thing, it'll be. Having so much fun, yeah. We're gonna be doing this uh, as long as until it, I freaking complete it, and then we still have two meter two and three to do as well. So, yeah, these streams are fun. Even the practice on this stuff is pretty fun. Eee. That's pretty close, dude. Natla's kind of a penetrator sometimes, so let's see about getting her just to shoot into the ceiling. she doesn't uh, go wild here because this is the ideal case with Natla honestly you can't bump off me and my brood so easy Lara if she just so if, hopefully she just stands there she, her AI does do this so
But sometimes she'll freaking go ham. Go on. Hey, she almost came in. Alright. Alright, okay, one more time. One more time. Oh my god, that's so close. But hey, that's perfect. Like, if I can... Oh my god. I hate that. I hate it when it hits me on, the, on that side, because it's definitely not hitting the hitbox. Or unless it is, and I don't know, I can't see where it's hitting. It's an invisible hitbox. You gotta die that way too, at least once. Alright. Man, lots of learning today. Lots of learning. Lots of hard learning too. Lots of humbling. There's been a lot of humbling. I think I'm a badass Tomb Raider, and then all of a sudden I start doing this crap, and I'm like, yeah. I'm not that great. I die in Thor's room like a noob. It's great. Oh, I'm hit. Oh, I'm not hit. Oh, whoa, I missed it. Son of a freaking dart. The flesh dart penetrated me again, guys. man there uh, yeah the center feels like it's never gonna hit <laughs> that jump is so hard to pull off gracefully in regular two meter one controls so is this jump, honestly. This whole sequence as well. Swimming around your vagina, let's go.
Alright, let's hope she doesn't run and gun this. I think this is definitely a success. This is a, this would be a successful run. That would be successful. Is this truly the last one? Yeah, man. I don't lie about things like that. Why would I play? I fallen off one of the pillars yet? I'm sure I have at some point. Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, not maybe not here. Maybe not in the remasters. But... Maybe I have in the remasters. end of the world the end of the stream i'm gonna call it here guys thanks a lot for coming by and watching me play some tomb raider um <laughs> we're gonna be doing some more of this stuff probably next weekend i'll probably stream i'll probably do an extra stream during the week since i didn't stream on uh thursday some elden ring we'll probably do some tomb raider stuff anyway because i want to do some more of this where this uh, no loads, no med stuff. It's fun. Uh, I want to get there. Oh, before I go, before I go, I'm not, not yet. I lied. I lied. <laughs> oh, wait, sunglasses. Freaking sunglasses. There we go. What have I learned today? Oh, somebody mentioned, Kid Jedi mentioned that if you do a dive here, and then you can just do another standing dive, then you're a that would actually make you completely safe. Freaking forgot the sunglasses. Oh, see, they, okay, you have to hold them during the load. That's crazy. Okay. All right. But for no lows, no meds, I'm gonna end up coming out here to the side and just jumping near that thing and yeah, it should be good. I think you can get away with not getting shocked on this tile, not in the corner of this tile. Cause this ball is actually, um, there, even though this game is tile based, there are half tile and quarter tile mechanics. This is one of them. This globe here is one of them. If I, so I'm on this corner quarter of a tile. If I get onto this quadrant of the tile, I'll get shocked, I think. Yeah, but not this one. 
Well, I was on that over there. Pretty interesting. That's just interesting stuff, man. Like, even though the game's tile-based, it's not entirely tile-based. There are quarter tile mechanics. And we can use them to our advantage here to avoid death. That's really cool, man. If I take, if I go, if I go to this quarter of the tile, I get hit. As long as I'm in this quarter, then the jump distance here is the is the best for the run jump. You just literally, you don't even get, you don't even step on anything that can kill you. Oh, that's that'll kill you. Oh no, wait, no. Like you literally can just, you can even even just line up a run and jump here. Boing. This is on the outer radius of that globe. It's good stuff. Okay, cool, man. Well, I, this room should never kill me again. All right, I will see you guys. Um, hopefully later. Please come by. Please come watch my wolverines. I'm a decent person. I'm a decent gamer, okay? I, I like it when people come to my streams. It makes Just me go. tingle.